Three, two, one. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's, that shit made me so nervous. I reach fucking time. Man. I don't know why it makes you nervous. All you have to do oh, is be man. ready. Welcome to another episode of Tequila Talk. My name is Walt Light Walt, aka Tequila Walt, aka Do Not Search My Old Tweets. I have grown, <laughs> aka Child of Payment, aka the Five Time Crock Pot Champ, aka you see me go gentle for weights. Approach me as you would a bear, aka my pronouns are I'm him. And we have Jazz Cooper in the building. Him is free this week. Hey. Him is free. <laughs> Him is in the, actually, I forgot. Damn, I forgot my other AK. Walk my rant was? in the strip club with my shirt off. <laughs> Guys, please make sure you're following us on social media, on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. Please make sure you're subscribed to our YouTube channel and wherever you listen to the show. Please make sure you download. That's how we count our streams. Hi, friend. I know, man. You know, n- niggas back in the street. Hide your hoes. Hide yeah. your wives. I saw you were out last night. My goodness. Hey, look, that wasn't my fault. Oh, whose fault was it? BG. Oh, of course. He was like, yeah. yo, I'm going to come tonight. Yeah. But, you know, I ain't seen in a while. I ain't seen yeah. why he was on house arrest. Let's, let's just hang out, you know, just yeah. kick it. I'm going to bring um, our homegirls. All right, well, I'll bring, you know. And so he went there. And yeah. I'm like, okay, it's a new spot in the city. I'm going to be low. Mm-hmm. Sit down. Let them smoke their hookah. I'm going to get a couple drinks. You know what I'm saying? See if there's any games Are you on. no longer a hookah hoe? No, yeah, I'm, I'm good. Mm-hmm. I mean, I've been clean for three months. Okay. okay. Well, actually, I've been clean for, four, I've been clean no, for like right. five months because I stopped in December. Yeah, I remember. Like four or five, I've been clean. I, just, I, I think just you should stay off the sauce. Like, yeah, I should. Yeah. Why you I stop? Should. Um, when I I run, and yeah, it gets it hurts right here. Oh. <laughs> right <laughs> here Understandable. When, okay. when, you the, when you hit the gym, it's like, <laughs> God damn. Yeah, different. I don't know. One day I just say I'm, I'm I was good. I was good. That's but yeah, bad. so we get there, and then I see Ooh. every motherfucker from fucking Lydia in the city in the bitch, and shout out to Tiana. She's like, Oh yeah, oh you're a free man now. First night out. And I look up and his bottle's coming to my table. Oh my God. Like, Good for you. That is not coming out of my chest. <laughs> that is not coming out of my pocket. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck y'all. Yeah. It didn't. <laughs> they covered it. Yeah. It was lit. So yeah, Paris looked after us and everything. So it was Hey, cool. shout out to Paris. Yeah, Paris, yeah, Paris was From the our, Girls uh, Eat 2 podcast. Yeah, girl, Paris was our bottle girls. Oh, of course. Waitress or whatever you yeah. want to call it. But it was cool. Your host. Yeah, hostess. There we go. Mm-hmm. Shit, it was cool. Bro. <laughs> it was cool. Just kick it. How does it feel? My, I lost two pounds. Okay. Because I was weighing myself with the anchor monitor on. <laughs> <laughs> but I took it off I'm like oh so this shit weighs two pounds so literally a weight lifted <laughs> off of you yes weight came off <laughs> alright you know what I'm saying so yeah. my ankle feels light I still yeah. when, I, when I lay down I'm like oh okay I don't gotta do that no more did you take like a jog around the block I ran today is there a light spot yeah. Is it a light spot on your ankle? Like, no, it ain't a light no? spot. It okay. just feel, it just feels like it just feels light now. Okay, mm-hmm. it's like damn, I was carrying this mm-hmm. <laughs> this MacBook on my leg. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it just feels a little light. Well, I'm happy for you. I know, man. Walk back in the streets. Yes, that was my top show. So we just I'm just done. I don't got I was top gonna say no that was gonna be my top show. So we just got yeah. out the way right now. Yeah, let's do this. Know me on the podcast. Me and Jazz do our one and two thing before we bring on the guests. Mm-hmm. But we have another podcaster in the building who's been building her own platform and doing her own numbers. Been out here killing shit. Thank so you. we have Ish. Yes. From Ish Your Heart Out podcast yes. in the goddamn building. You're not gonna hear the class. They're gonna come and post credit. Okay. Here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got a crowd here. Let's make some yeah, noise real make quick. Some noise. <laughs> I'm with the entourage today. Well, Each like, came with the uh, with the entourage. Yeah, she came with like, the mob, all makeup. Philly niggas. I was gonna say, should have pad these motherfuckers down. Makeup, security. As you know, you're holding. Well, I was, manager, like, I, I, I was slipping. We, I should say they should went to the middle black, detector first. Black, did you pack pack them down? Seriously, yeah, Philly niggas crazy. Man. I, was gonna yeah, say, yes, I, I don't yes. mess with I don't mess with Philly boys or girls. Uh uh-uh. uh. Why? Y'all we're, are. we're perfect. You guess you got a baby daddy for Philly. Yeah. You do? I do. Well, I understand why. Fuck it. <laughs> yeah. Leave him in the back. Yeah. <laughs> we don't need him. <laughs> yeah, leave him in the back. For yeah. real. How are you doing today? I'm really good. Thanks oh. for having me. Well, thanks for coming on, man. See you. Oh, wow. Oh, I you love it. Thanks for having me. You popping. Yeah. <laughs> you know, the nigga popping. You know, nigga popping come to the city. We ain't going to have him on the, on the show. <laughs> Seriously. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. No, how was the drive up? DC traffic is ridiculous. Yeah, I was talking to Jazz about it. Like yeah. I thought Philly was crazy. You know, DC is like CP time. You need to add an hour to that. Yeah, like, it yeah no, ridiculous. today was bad. Today yeah. was really it was bad. bad. Yeah. Is it, it was a my party? first day out. Oh yeah, everybody, why everybody coming outside for the party tonight? You know what? They were like, no, this nigga walk back in the streets. Everybody outside. They, they yeah. trying to leave the city because he gonna take our wives. <laughs> yeah, he gonna be fucking our bitches. We gotta go back. He's to gonna go back somewhere else. <laughs> Maybe it was bad today all over the city. I don't know. I also think like when the when it's a warm Friday. Yeah, that kind of increases the amount of traffic. 
everybody want to go outside and eat and yeah, drink and, and just rooftop, be around and yeah. happy hour but yeah. yum, 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 so yeah let's do it alright so look here this is Tequila Talk and uh, we don't do interviews we just have conversations with yes. our guests and um, just basically have fun uh, yeah I, fuck, I forgot to spill today I'm just like excited like a little uh, you really <laughs> are I was actually my, my eyelashes my, the glue is, is stuck on my lid so whenever I close my eye it's like <laughs> well, yeah, we just have conversations basically with people we don't really do interviews okay. so and we do this with people that we feel are pushing the culture for or doing yeah. their own goddamn thing so look yes. here this is cheers to you yes cheers cup, yeah get you, you cheers guys. to you yes yes to yes. much yes. more thank success you. thank you thank you thank you Dad's you brought my man Lur oh, in here you. <laughs> yes <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to get the picture thank uh, you alright let's get it so how are you feeling today man I'm feeling so good. I mean, you know, I'm single. I came to DC to find me a man. Ooh, oh, you will find one I'm tonight. I'm trying to find me a man. You'll find, you find, you'll find, find a man. one oh, tomorrow you know, and you'll funny? find one Sunday. Because when Medina came here, she was like, I'm going on a date. And she's been with some that person ever say, since. She's no, I, I don't want to get locked down. I want to have some fun. I want to stay single for a while. Oh, so you want somebody oh. to drop dick off. I don't want to drop dick off, but I mean. You're down for I a little can, fun yeah, tonight. Yeah, a little fun tonight. Maybe. How aggressive are you? You can have some fun tonight. It depends on the man. If the man is a weak acting man, I'm gonna be very aggressive. Grip him up, make him sit down. See, yeah, see. <laughs> but I'm very innocent, really. Aggressive girl scared the fuck out of me. I'm like, yo, this is a setup. Why? You said you gonna line me up, like, yo, what's up? Like, hey, you know I like to suck dick. I'm like, okay, well, look. <laughs> I ain't that aggressive now. I'm gonna sneak it in. <laughs> that actually happened in my DMs yesterday wow i was like hey like the show like thank you uh, you know i love sucking dick I'm like whoa, whoa. what the f okay this yeah. is okay let me look through the pictures this this is this is a dude it's, it's, <laughs> this is weird yeah. i'm cool well I, I have a question well i just thought yeah. about it right i don't know jazz i, I yeah. get a bunch of dick pics do you get pussy pics in your dm I, I got a white girl playing with her pussy and i blocked her well I, actually i told her to say black lives matter first <laughs> <laughs> i'm Why not lying what? I'm not. No, lying. he's no. being serious. He did and she saw actually that. saw the clip, and she because I, I, I didn't follow her back. She saw the clip and DM me like, so he's gonna put me out there no. on your podcast. I'm like, you, if I didn't say your name, did she say it? She, so I was like, yo, it's like she said she wanted to see me or something. I was like, oh, just say Black Lives Matter first. She just said Black Lives. She Matter. said that shit. <laughs> okay, Susie. Okay, <laughs> listen. Made the bitch say Black Are you blocked or you ain't giving no dick walk? Fuck no. <laughs> You selfish with your dick? Says, yes, yes, I am. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Did you learn that by the way, like, or you always been selfish with your dick? Oh, I've never been. I've never I've been. I've been He's fucking every. I've been fucking. No, fucking I've been fuck, I just don't want to die. And somebody hear that I'm self, not selfish with the dick. She will hang me by a. Uh, yeah, she your will. Balls. Yeah, she would. Yeah. She would murder me. Oh, you're in a relationship. Yeah. Oh, I'm she sorry will, to hear will, that. Not be joking. She would stab me. That's cool. Yeah. yeah. He is just stab him. Are you in a relationship also, Jess? No, God. Mm mm. Mm -mm. She's actually a stabber. Is she? Like he's still over here. I'd be, be saying, I'd be saying the wild shit on the podcast. Like it's a character, baby. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's then, my she, then, she, then she see me in the, in the, in the VIP with, with the girls around. Like, oh, you in character? I'm in character right now too. We just flying. She will whoop his ass. Yeah, she 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 yeah. brought the knife out one night. It's yeah. been a long time. You been in a relationship with her? Uh, I forgot how long. It yeah, been. I, that's it's sad. Been a while. Been. Stop counting after a while. Yeah, she must be amazing because I feel like it takes a lot to kind of keep you in check. Oh yeah. 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 I'm a wild yeah. dude. You know, catch me on the road. Anyway. 2023 about to happen. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Twitter is like sweating over Freak Nick. They shouldn't be. In DC, you should be sweating over NEG pool party videos coming out. Wow. From oh, 94. Wow. <laughs> I watched those. My dad I got caught. You know, and I think people are saying like, "Oh, this is just another opportunity to drag black men and make black men look no, they bad." Had the, we watched documentaries. You seen the girls going wild one? We've seen I that seen one. We saw the Woodstock documentary oh, that was all about literally yeah. how those men were, they were raping, raping, date Crazy. raping, groping, raging, and how those men are the same men who Ooh. ended up being on January 6th. Oh, wow. Yeah, they yeah. are the same guys. That, that, that white rate, middle class white rage started back then, and that's how January 6th happened. Oh, so, wow. fair is fair. Fair is fair. What's your name? Oh, he's across your leg. Like, okay. <laughs> he, he, the mic. he said it in the mic. <laughs> that's but, weird. Nah, nah. Okay. I was thinking, I actually... Fuck the Freaknet videos. Hmm. My dad doesn't know this. I watched another one of his videos that he had, the cam camcorder oh, videos. Oh, God. Luke Freak Show. It oh, got yeah. nasty. Yeah. <laughs> when they do yeah. the documentary on Luke Freak Show. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That's what you people lit. need to be worried about <laughs> yes. for real, Luke Show. Luke Freak Show. Yeah. They had an ass eating contest. I remember that. <gasps> an ass eating oh, contest? Oh, well, first, first, that first time. Actually, that was the time I went. It was 2008. 
eight or seven. Why was he there? Yeah, it was because I was in Miami. You got, <laughs> oh my you got, you got, I got in VIP and everything, and, and, and then I got kicked out when they realized Wait, I didn't time, belong time, in the time. Who was eating? Who asked for the eight minutes? Well, more than that, how do you know if you won? That's a good question. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, but I remember. I remember you guys. It was a couple of cues that went to Hampton. I saw mm. you. Shut <laughs> up. Y'all was eating ass on stage. It was lit though. They had dicks up oh, the contest with okay. the women, and like whoever made the man come first won. Which it doesn't that doesn't equate to anything. And then there was an ass eating contest. Like I said, when the Luke Freak Show videos come out, it's gonna get crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> That's disgusting, honestly. Yeah. I, I wouldn't want to be. I, uh, you wouldn't go. I wouldn't want to participate in an ass eating contest. No. That's kind of crazy. Because I wouldn't want to have an orgasm on stage. That feels awkward to me. You Can orgasm, you have an orgasm and get ass eating? That's a good question. Absolutely. The, what? The, the felon did it, did he? <laughs> no, not the felon. No, no, I'm asking. The felon did it, did he? No, it's someone else. You had an orgasm Jazz, while you eating ass. What? Yeah. Just ass, strictly ass eating. It was a combination. Okay, okay. okay. Oh, okay. The little, you that know. That makes sense now. Okay, about to say combination ass. gotta go. Yeah. 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 <laughs> kind of like, you know, the little vacuum move from bottom top, bottom top, uh, bottom top, back, back forth. Okay, back, I like that. Back, yeah. I like With that one. the orgasm part, I was confused. I thought it was just like ass. I'm like, <laughs> wow. Like, I'm calling my man and that would be, like, yeah. That would be intense. I've never, just at, no, I don't think so. I like to come like with the guy like sitting like on his knees and I'm standing up. That's my favorite way to come. Have you ever done it before? What the mm-hmm. fuck just happened? No. Wait, you like mm-hmm. to come? What, what do you mean? The guy's on his knees and I'm standing up. Yeah. You never like and you you can like remote so you, control him. Yeah, you yeah. are you are aggressive. No, I'm just saying that's like really like that's good. Okay. I don't think that's that aggressive, honestly. Yeah. yeah. You just standing up and he's on his knees. Can I make him, okay, you, you know? Put your, you put your leg on, you put your, you put your one leg on the couch, like, yeah, yeah. come here. He's it like, was a couch. And you're just getting topped <laughs> off, basically. Y'all like the same thing. Y'all exactly. like the same thing. You like Remy Ma and the Escalade in that oh, motherfucking no, video. No, no, that was a lot. She <laughs> was moving <laughs> his head. That was a lot. She was getting really getting his head and moving his head around like this. That was crazy. <laughs> I've that never was masculine. It was a, what was it? What that was video? a lot. What music video was that? What video was that? Was it Lean Back? Was it was lean back? back. That was wow. She, she was getting top. She was having. She that, was rapping while doing this to a nigga. That's too much. Oh, I don't remember that. Oh, no. I definitely remember she that. She was part. really like this, getting hit. I ain't seeing that. I'm just saying, like, keep you close to me, and I'm yeah. coming. Like, I don't want you to like yeah. suck my clit. That's wild. Like, oh, not on man. camera, not on a music video. That's, oh, that's funny. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh man. Anyway, so we have you on the show. Um, yes. We want to know. Oh, we want our listeners to learn more about you. So, what made you want to get into podcasting? Uh, well, um, of course, I'm on the LL Network, Learn Lionel. Uh, it's I did LL their podcast. Yes. Oh, the yes. network. Yes. LL Network. Yeah. Woo-hoo. When we get signed, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> he's a nut he's such a nut uh, I did that podcast and you know Lur that being a marketing genius that he is he was like let's do a pod and I was like no I'm too shy he was like where shy? he was like where you shy at I'm like I don't I can't do it but we did it one day and it kind of like worked out for the best and I mean I literally just get on there and speak my mind I talk about like all my past relationships and my present relationships like my sexual experiences and things I would cry about back then Jazz like mm-hmm. I would be sad about I mm-hmm. laugh at now and I kind of go through situations like you know so are a majority of your shows just you or you and a guest it's mainly just me I just I haven't guessed recently mm-hmm. people always say I want to come on the show so I have guests now but for, you know for the most part it's me and I have producers in the background yeah, talking to yeah, me I was about to say I'd be hearing yeah. like Lionel Alert talking yeah. in the they a mess working with Lionel is very hard that was is actually it? a question that oh was actually a gosh. question for you yes. that was just, see how it is to work with them niggas <laughs> they're crazy <laughs> they're crazy like but they bring the best out of me so talking to them uh, it's always like fun it's good and they just they let me be my, I'm, I'm myself on the yeah. show and yeah. they talk to me but uh, they ask me the craziest questions sometimes so now that I've been doing it for eight months, it's only been eight mm-hmm. months. That's been Word. a long time. It's eight months. Shit moving. It's moving quick, right? Yeah. So it's a little it's scary good, so like, sometimes. What, two, two and a half, three years together? Yeah. To get it popping. It takes long, right? And yeah, I, I just been like in a good space, like having like, I guess I have a lot of line they just marketing geniuses. So uh, yeah, talking to them makes it fun. So. Is it difficult being by yourself just talking? At first it was, mm-hmm. you know, because it's like you're talking to yourself and then men don't understand everything you're talking about. Mm-hmm. So if I'm talking about some girl things, it kind of don't get it. They just keep asking questions, right? Mm-hmm. Um, but uh, now I just, I have so much stuff going on in my life. I feel like I just get on camera and that's like my therapy. You just talk. And I'm just talking, yeah. you know, I'm just letting people know like what's going on in my life. And I found like so many people who understand what I'm going through and we can like converse. So it, it works out. You, yeah. you know, DM me it, and ask questions. But. How does it feel being a, a, a woman Run the podcast and posting your content on the internet because me and her be going through it. So initially it was crazy, <laughs> right? Because men don't like when women are uh, 
we we are sexual liberated, yep. right? Outspoken. They hate or you it. Don't fit into the mold of what they think you should be and, and how you should react. This podcast exactly. turned me to a semi-feminist. Like, I'll be going seriously. on niggas. I'll be going on niggas in the comments like, "What you say about Jack?" Yes, and, I, and that's Lara. Lara, fight you for me, right? And that's hard because you know it's like. They want you to be, what's the saying? Uh, a freak in the bed by a lady in the streets, mm-hmm. or however you say it, right? They want mm-hmm. you to be like that always. It's like, mm-hmm. don't talk about it in front of people, but be a freak. Mm-hmm. Like, no. well, well, why how can't do I talk you about it? Yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. Yeah. They sit there and watch Lauren Lionel talk about pussy and dicks for two All hours. Day like, long. It's lit. Yes, but I say, <laughs> I say one dick, they're like, oh my gosh. Like, you know, but um, I feel like I can be everything. I can go to church sometimes. Yeah. And I can still get dick. Sometimes. What's up with that? You get what I'm saying? Like, yeah. so people don't like it, but I don't care. Because, I mean, I can be myself. I feel the same way. Like we we talked about this last week when we were at the Made in the DMV conference about how like him and I can say the same thing mm-hmm. or he can say something actually significantly worse, more ignorant, more offensive. And right. I do. And <laughs> I, I just get killed. Yeah. Oh my god. Jazz, what I learned recently is is never really the women who kills you. No, it's, it's the, the men. men. It's the the men. men will go it's in and say, "I've been called ugly, fat. No one wants you, bitch." I'm yeah. like, "Somebody do." Like Lord, like you know, oh, like, I've, I've gotten it. So all. yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. It'd be the dudes with uh, that follow five thousand people and a hundred people follow. Yeah, them. Listen, it'd be the one with the anime <laughs> pictures. It'd be an anime man on, on his picture. You get what I'm saying? Oh, like, I'm getting like, damn, nigga, like that's the ones that scare me. Like they gonna see me in the streets, like that's that nigga. Like, I don't and know you what you look like. Know them. You never know. I don't you know what you never look know like who they are. Right? They strapped yeah. up. Yeah, seriously, <laughs> seriously. And they say like the most outlandish shit, mm-hmm. and it's just like, you know, I, I think that I've learned. Well, if I'm bored, I get in the comments. You I definitely do. do. Yeah. She do. They if always tell me not to because I'm bored, crazy. Because yeah. y'all, because they are smart. You shouldn't. You I, mean, shouldn't I try to tell her all the time, yeah. like, yo, yeah. don't, don't. And she they goes, want the attention. Right. Yeah, you know, exactly. don't give it to them. Exactly. It, you know, like I, I'm literally making your day by even speaking exactly. to you. Exactly. But you know, if you get too re- disrespectful, you say something dumb. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna respond to that really? because it's like, yeah, like somebody today was like. Oh, because we posted a video about some Twitter shit, blah, blah, blah. And then we both had to say something like, y'all, read the captions. Like, read all these captions. Like, we are simply talking about something on Twitter. And this person was like, well, you post content to go viral. And when it goes viral, you want to cry about it. And I was like, no, actually, we just do what we normally do. And we expect people to exercise their reading comprehension, which clearly you can't. No response. They, they don't do, they don't, listen, I can put a clip out, they'll watch the first three seconds and have a, a like, a essay. dissertation. Yeah, she's like, first of all, you didn't even watch the whole, the whole yeah. essay. You didn't even watch the whole clip. You know what I'm saying? This like, is why I was wrong with black people in America. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> right. they, they, I be loving those. I don't oh my God. They talk, she, they talk so much about how like this show is mm-hmm. the corrupting black morals yes. and black conversation. Like, bitch, we just talking about pussy. That's oh my it. God. They say you too old. Right. We 30. Like, we not even thinking about that. We would be them. 17 talking about having Sex? That like, would not be say? appropriate. Yeah, I, I blocked my god door in my pipe. I blocked it. Oh, you have to. The kids, you have to block family, the family. Yeah, yeah. yeah. like, she thinks I could get her backstage to see little baby. I'm like, look here. That's a no. I yeah. don't know who you think I am. <laughs> but not, not that nigga. Your, your Godfather ain't got it. Yeah. I get you backstage to see Fat Trail. <laughs> Fat Trail. Shout out to, shout out to Gleesh. Ain't no this. Shout out to Gleesh. I'm just saying. I know my, I know my limitations. Exactly. Listen. <laughs> But Jess, one thing I do to make sure I'm not going crazy with the comments, I I make myself realize that I birth niggas. Like, yeah. oh, wow, me, y'all niggas wouldn't be here. Yeah. So what the fuck we talking about? That's you know what, what I said. Like, like, I just got to the conclusion, like, <laughs> I don't care what the internet thinks. The yeah. internet cares what I think. Exactly. So. Exactly. Keep scrolling. You're going to look at it. And, and that's the other part about it. I'm like, this is not like paid subscribe mm-hmm. content that we're dropping into your inbox yeah. and like forcing you to watch. Yeah. Like, you could simply just scroll. Not look at it. Just, I would just going. always say, just never let them, never let anyone, you know, get you and your feelings. I wouldn't yeah. respond. Yeah. There's uh, some comments though that I it's do. It's hard. Yeah, I understand. They say nasty things and I'm like, okay, that was kind of right. mean. Honestly, yeah. What's up with y'all feeling niggas? Y'all just get born on how to drop bars. You said I birth niggas. Just, <laughs> name the podcast. I do too. I <laughs> talk on the so much shit now. I be like, oh okay. Like, niggas just <laughs> Philly just they born with sixteen bars, <laughs> ready, ready to go at any fucking time. Yeah. Jay Z walk in the building. It's rap. Got you. <laughs> I've been waiting for this like, moment. Thank you. Thank you. All. Thank you. <laughs> it's like, damn. I'm a karaoke queen. Yeah. Oh, word. I love karaoke. This nigga love karaoke too. You do. I love like, karaoke. Yeah, I'm outside now. I'm not hit the yes. karaoke bar. Yeah. I've yes. been a karaoke bar in a long time. Oh, they get active, mm-hmm. they get active in the war. No, they, they have fun, but <laughs> I haven't been. Last time I went, I was in New York years ago. It was fun. I love it. Yeah. What I do you? What, um, 
have you noticed, I guess, since you say you're shy, what have you noticed <laughs> as far as your personality changed since starting the show? I'm, I've always been the same, but I've noticed people change from me now, mm. which is weird, you know, because like trying to date, I want to find someone who doesn't know I have a podcast, number one, right? Because when you have a podcast, mm-hmm. they go and try to research and see what you like. And I might be talking shit. I might say, I like when niggas carry chickens on their arm and you come out here with a chicken in your arm. Like, I was joking. Like, where you a chicken? So it's like people are changing for me now and I don't want that. I like genuine people. I want to have fun. I want to laugh. I don't want to be too serious. You know, I want to have some fun right now. That's lit. So, That's a good person. Yeah. Right? I like people that mm-hmm. have fun. That's I think, most, I think most dudes like girls that have fun. Well, a certain percentage of dudes. I would say some yeah, dudes are fucking weird. serious as fuck fucking these Fucking weird yeah. shit. Yes. Maybe serious shit. I like people that have fun. You know? I, especially yeah. my life. I, I, I've been, well, I'm going to get deep. I, I remember one year I went to nine funerals. I've been almost going to jail. Oh my God. I want to have fun. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be, I mean, Jazz, don't look away like that. This is actually like hurt my, this actually hurts my I'm heart. I'm smiling my, my, for My girlfriend photograph. died the night before my birthday one time. It was fucked up. Seriously? <laughs> yeah, that's serious. She's died. Oh, I, oh my God, what? That's Way horrible. I'm sorry to, to hear that. Bring the vibe. <laughs> yeah. I still don't get deep, but that's no. why I like people that want to have fun. Because if I can look at shit and make it, like, I'll make a joke out of it. No. All right, let's refresh. <laughs> Jesus, Jazz. I don't cut you off. I I'm a free man. I want to talk about shit. I didn't shit. cut you off, but I don't want to talk about nobody passing either. Well, I was moving on. I'm just saying, I was explaining why I like people that have fun. Because some people, that that would happen to them. They be yeah. like, serious fuck. Life, life is short. They be dry as hell. Like, nah, nigga, you realize, at that point, you realize life is short. And you're like, I'm gonna make the most out of this book oh, while yeah. I'm here. Agree. Yeah. Cheers to that. That's what she is. Come Char- on. Yes. Cheers. Cheers. Everybody have a drink. Yes. Today's my day. Yes. You can't hate today. You're right. All right. You can't hate today. I'll allow you. I'll allow it. You gotta I'll let me it. rock. I'll allow it. Just search today. Oh fuck. Did you see snow? I know you did. You saw snowfall this week? Oh my gosh. I love, I love snowfall. snowfall. I yeah. love snowfall. I was very disappointed in Sissy. Like oh yes, she can wait two more seconds. Uh, just a two half. more. Give me my seventy three or thirty seven. I don't care. Let me take. Like whatever. part of me was like, okay, she did it because she wanted this to be over. Like she knew that once he transferred the money, then that was going to be a thing. Then frankly, we have to get the money, and then da, 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 da. so I think she was just trying to like dead everything. But girl, three seconds. Come on, man. Not even three. Like he was saying, okay, the passcode, pat whatever yes. the line was. The password didn't kill him. What? That was crazy. He, he said, password is password. He, he said, pa- <laughs> I like just just hold it, hold it. Give me a he, I know he. No, I'm sorry. That was the best part of that show. That was no, 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 no. The part, no, not that part when he got oh. he died. It was the part when he said, "She's like, what? What jealousy is like." Are you fucking dumb? Look, yes. I shot the nigga two times yes. and buried the body. But yes. Anyway, I'm like, no, yo. That was crazy. My nigga. The I knew he was lying. Was bitch. I loved it. Yeah. He was like, what? Get the fuck? He literally was, I was like, lying, bitch. Like, <laughs> he looked at her like, are you dumb? Like, no, I made that up. Like, no, he's dead. I was so mad at her. Like, I mean, but who brings their mom? To a drug, the first all he was fucking up. That's true. Leave mom at home. That's true. That Leave was not, home at this point. Yeah. She was already was stressed. That out. was not a good decision. Her to hair bring stopped. Her. She stopped doing her hair. She had at the beginning of the show, her hair was done. She, she, she looked like Draymond Green. Yeah, she just oh. was trying to any old way. She You're like, right. You knew she was gonna stress the fuck out. Her like, hair did stop being done. Yeah, you yeah. knew what's gonna happen. You're right. Leave mom at home. Yeah, that was not that disappointed me. Did you see the Boston Marathon documentary? Yeah, actually, I did. You did not? I did. Oh, what'd you think? Lily Two Titty. I didn't see it. Please catch me up. What happened? No, the nigga, the, the part where what? they motherfucking was doing the shootout. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. The shootout, that he was, was throwing wild. pipe bombs and blowing yeah. the police and shit. Yeah. Oh, this shit is lit. I thought he was on PCP or something. Oh, when he got, he got getting shot and walking towards people? Yeah, but they said it's like when your adrenaline gets pumping at a certain um, point. That sh- so the, the documentary is about the Boston Marathon bombings that happened almost 10 years ago. Okay, but this By is those, old, right? Yeah, no, no, no. they brought on Netflix. They brought on Netflix. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. I the saw Netflix. They dropped like yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry, okay. we didn't warn you. We, sometimes we bring up. No, it's fine. No, I thought it was a new one, but I think I did see that one before. Oh, no, 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 it just came out. I was just saying sometimes we bring up uh, okay. certain shows we watch yeah. and then, then move on real quick. Oh, that's fine. Nope, I'm and here. And so they talk about how, like, obviously the bombing, how they found the guys, what happened afterwards, the chaos that ensued, and then how how they captured them and, and killed one of them. So is that the one that was they was hiding in a trampoline in somebody's house? No, it was they like, were, no in a boat. boat, boat, boat. In a boat. In a boat. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, I saw it. I saw yeah. it. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, yeah. The, the boat was like a <laughs> block away from where he from where he abandoned ran. the car. That's so crazy. I, it was and they, also, they shut the whole city down for like a day because so they couldn't crazy. find him. He was, he was a block, block away. Literally a block away. But you you shut down the whole city and make everybody sit in the house and look and search. You can't find. You can't find them. But what kind of friends you have? 
in life that you like, I'm bored. Me too. We'll kill some niggas. Let's go. No, they, they were brothers. Brother. No, they were brothers. They were brothers. Oh, that was the, that was the, the big older brother. brother. And then the little brother. Yeah. The little brother ran over the, little, the big brother. You think By so? accident. No, he By did. Accident. Yeah. By accident. He did. Yeah. Oh, when he was trying to get away. Yeah. They, were shooting, they, they had shoot up with police and he was throwing pipe bombs. Damn. And then he got in the car. Oh, in the gas station. Yeah. Nah. It was even the gas station, right? Exactly. They yeah. they carjacked a guy at the yeah. gas station. And then when the police closed in on him, they got into a shootout. Right. And the little bro got in the car to speed off. He was trying to hit officers. Right. He didn't realize it was his brother that's on so the ground. Crazy. Ran him over. That's crazy. Yeah. And that's what actually ended up killing him. Wow. Yeah. It was good. I thought the Chinese man was funny as hell. Because he was like, he had that Benz. He was happy about that Benz. I know. They, they took me from my Benz. <laughs> And he was like, "Yes, I memorized my GPS number. That yes, was my he did. first That's car. so weird, isn't it?" He said, he said my first, he was his first Benz. He memorized. I, know, everything. I knew everything. <laughs> yeah, he, he was like, "I remember." Yeah. I was like, "Damn, who remembered the GPS number?" Like, I was like, "I don't know the tracking number of my like. I don't know my VIN number. I barely, I don't think I even know my tag number. I no. have a photo in my car in my phone." And the probably letters and numbers too. That's what it takes. Yeah, I have no you know idea. You know your number? I said, I don't know my. T- I ain't got a car no more. <laughs> I don't know my <laughs> tag numbers. Bitch. Nope. I you know don't what drive color. anything. DC well, is crazy. To I, drive. I can't drive for a couple of years. Uh, <laughs> I watched the clip. <laughs> I watched it. I'm sorry, I did. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, no. Um, when else do this? Normally on our show we do a uh, top shelf and bomb shelf. Okay. So let's go ahead and start with Jeff. Uh, both our top shelves we already said. Was you getting out of jail? Yes, which me, is nice. Me getting yeah. off a uh, house arrest. Yes. Yeah. Now, actually, I want to ask you if you have a top show. The top show is something you want to highlight this week. That's something that you fuck with. <sighs> oh, this week. This week, right? Or anytime. Um, something yeah. You fuck with. So, right, with this week, um, confront the people that you have an issue with. Because I feel like mm-hmm. it's best to like talk it out than to keep it, bury it, and then always have that like tension. Yeah, the tension between two people. You know, I went through with someone else. I, uh, I guess I could say work with, I guess. Yeah. And um, something happened through text, and I hate texting. You can't tell when somebody's texting. serious. The tone. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You, can't, yes. you can't tell the tone. Yes. And and now it's to the point, uh, I was with her last night, and we didn't talk about it, and I wanted to. Hmm. And I was just saying, I was driving here. I'm like, I'm going to call her, because I like to confront everything in life. I don't like to just kind of like leave things sitting. Yeah, so, man, yeah, that's, that's my top shelf then. Like, I'm just a, confront I'm a everything. Person. Mm-hmm. And, but you don't have to be like mean or argumentative. Yeah, confrontational wanna, yeah. doesn't always mean argumentative. Yeah. yeah. You could just kind of like clear, the, clear it up. Clear the air. You know, I don't yeah. want it to be a problem with anybody. Like you said, life is so short. I literally want to have fun, yeah, and just have a good conscience and not be mean to people. Yeah. Judge, you have a bottom shelf? Um, it is, but you wouldn't know about it. So my bottom shelf goes to Melissa Gorga from Real Housewives of New Jersey. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I, got this one. I can't mm-hmm. stand that thirsty ass hoe. <laughs> oh my god, she's just a liar, liar, liar. So, and not to say Teresa is right. Teresa is obtuse. She cannot take accountability for her actions. Mm-hmm. She always blames others. Everybody else is the problem. But Melissa, she ain't she ain't no good. No. She ain't no good. She ain't no good. I rewatched season three, her first season on the show. She ain't no good from jump. So she gets my bottom shelf. Teresa is just like the queen though. I exactly. Of, I feel like you can do right or wrong. I'm totally fine with her. Her yeah. and Nene, I don't give a fuck what y'all do. Exactly. That's exactly love y'all how I feel about life. them. Like, like queens, you know? Teresa and Nene are yeah. wrong a lot of times, lot but of times. it doesn't really matter because it's Teresa and Nene. It's, it's, so they just get a pass. They so. get a pass. They yeah. get a pass. Again, I'm not, Teresa got some shit with her too, but yeah. Don't Melissa, we all? Right. Two thumbs down <laughs> for me. What's something fucked up? Basically, that's your bottom shelf. What's something fucked up? Something that's fucked up. That you don't like. Oh, man. Um, the more... Something that's fucked up. I don't want to go too crazy. Okay. It could be... It doesn't have to be something from your personal life. No. Pop culture. What well, well, personal life. News. Something that's fucked up. I feel like these... Like, 2023, I've only met men that had really small penises. And I feel like that's Ooh, fucked up. That's very fucked that's up. That's your bad luck. That's yeah. my bad luck. That's my karma. Yeah. I did somebody you, wrong you, last yeah. year. You, you, yeah. you fucked somebody yeah. and, and ghosted him. Oh. And he has a motherfucking voodoo doll. All right, Laura Hill. You're reading me right yeah. now. Like... <laughs> <laughs> he has a voodoo doll that every person she yes. meets gonna be shrimp dick. Yes. But sometimes I heard the shrimp make you limp. Never will it ever. I can never imagine. <laughs> I can never imagine a shrimp making you limp. That'd be crazy. We no. had a guest. She said the shrimp really? made her limp. Jazz. Not Disagree. jazz. Disagree. It was somebody else. Yes. She was like, the, she said the shrimp made her limp. No way. There ain't no way. I have never. There ain't no You can't way. work the middle. Look, I'm saying you can't work the middle if you think too little. Like, how yeah. are we even doing this? Like, what? How are we gonna do this? You see what I'm saying? But I feel like, yeah, it's probably someone of voodoo that out, like getting me out of here. Yeah. Cause like, so, how you, well, we're, we're in DC. <laughs> mm-hmm. So, you, <laughs> if you meet a dude tonight, 
And whenever, whenever it gets to that point, and he he's out here with the pinky, you might nigga, no. nigga, I should be celibate for a while. Ser- uh, Listen, I've never yeah. had a one night stand in my life before. Really? Okay, but now do I've you define many. a one night stand <laughs> as someone you meet and you have sex at night, yep. or is it someone who you've only had sex with once? Someone I only had sex with once. Someone who I just met that day and yeah. we had sex that night. Okay. Yeah, all of so both. I've never ever done it before. I would yeah. love to, but I feel like I think too much. Me too. Yeah, I'm like, am I I've gonna die? I got a disease. Yeah. Where? She knows a part of town. Oh. It's, it's it's what, part what, town. What does that equate to? It's like is that like Broad Street or something? No way, Jose. It's what, like what um, that equate to in Philly. What, what is it? What Adams it's like Morgan. A, it's like a bunch of bars. It on the would strip. be like um, oh, like, like South, South Street. Street. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, yeah, yeah, we fucked in the bathroom. Oh, in heaven and hell, which is a bar. Yeah. Wait, you just met her that day and y'all had sex in the bathroom? Yeah, we was vibing. Yeah, you used the shots, huh? That was hard. You heard that? That was hard. I ain't gonna See? hold you. That those three days waiting for the results was the longest three days I no, had in my life. I'm no. saying I get the, I did the blood work and everything. I'm like, all right, man, I'm gonna get the call sometime. I never had like a, a full one night stand. Back in the day, I'm over fucking wild days. Mm-hmm. Oh, you grew up. Mm-hmm. Now I had a a, a, day, a long day date. Okay. And we did have sex that night, so okay. we went to like he picked me up. We went to lunch. Then we went on a boat ride. Oh, then we went for drinks. Then we went to Griffin, got a table. Got a table? Yeah. Sorry, he deserves some pussy. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know that. We went to four stops. Like, yes. he got, he. He was working for that he pussy. Worked, he yeah. worked for that we pussy. We literally, like, were in Georgetown, which is by the water. Okay. And there's, like, there's boats there, but you can kind of, this is pre pandemic. So you could kind of get on a boat if you just paid the captain. So he tipped the captain, and he the captain took us on a boat ride. We came back, had drinks, went to went oh, to worked. Griff. Yes. So yeah, I gave him some that night. He's been yeah, good. Yeah. He's about a good two bands. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I gave him. I gave him a little something. Was it good? Was was the sex good too? It was, was okay. Good it was, um, was okay. Um, it was. All he's that? he's he's, he's um he was small. <sighs> Yeah, we those be the ones who don't how to date guys who have big dicks. But don't care how they date you. Always like he would <laughs> always up, try man. and get me in these <laughs> crazy <laughs> ass like positions what? and like like a pretzel. Literally, no. Uh, he would like squat and try and like, put, and I'm like, he did hot yoga. Something. <laughs> I'm like, I can't get with all. Like, I'm uh, I'm a simple girl. You That's don't need to lie. be doing all you know what's this. Funny? That's we a actually lie. had this conversation before we started the uh, the show before y'all got here about an mm-hmm. underrated position that mm-hmm. niggas don't care about no. Well, they care, but niggas don't talk about no more. And that's missionary. You can do I five. Different, I do like yes. five or six different positions in missionary. missionary. Yes. I got the, you got the power driver this back here. You got the toe toe and mouth. <laughs> Sometimes I put the legs crisscross applesauce. You, know, it's, you can do a lot of things. Do missionary. Like, it's like, set, like you could go through about six different positions right there. I like back in the day. Was like back in the day, you like do? Jamie Foxx bitch ass. Put that. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait. he had a stroke. I hope we get. Uh, I was gonna <laughs> say, yeah, in no Take way are we calling because Jamie Foxx. Because I was thinking Fox. about that song. Uh, he was like uh, unpredictable. Mm-hmm. Where he's like missionary. Uh, uh, no, no, no. <laughs> you know, he's like that's born, and he does this other shit. So yeah. everybody out there heard. Yeah, that, like, but Jamie yeah, Foxx one leg up, is the the most, on one of the most but, talented people uh-huh, in the United yeah, States. He do everything. Like, yeah, yeah, but yeah, Hobie gets Hobie gets well. He, they say yeah. he has stroke. I found out he has stroke. Yeah, that's fucked up. Yeah, but I don't want a guy who doesn't read the room. If we having sex and my leg is up, you see I'm in pain. Yeah, let my leg go, bro. Or like if you're what trying to pull it and it's tight, yes, like don't like don't stretch keep push it. Push it. Like, like, I need to start doing some yoga or some shit. Because I want I want I want knees to forehead. Knees to forehead. No, no, no. I just had to think. I was like knees to knees to forehead. Maybe if I turn around and I'm like you know from the back, but not from the from the front. Hell no. Put your back. No, I mean wow. Power driver time. That's how you gotta do it to niggas. You gotta treat them like that. I you, when you when you ride him, you gotta be like, give me your leg and put, put it up. Oh. <laughs> well, put the leg up like this, and, and see how you like that shit. Y'all gonna be bitching, leg all shaking and shit. You know what? Come on, hey, no. treat, treat him the same. I'm telling you, okay, you on top. Wait. You gonna put my leg back? Yes. So you basically you fucking yes. him. Yes. No, yeah. that's, that you Listen, fucking him. You gotta fuck him sometimes. There's nothing wrong with that. You know. Listen. Thank you for that information. Yes. Because now. I swear okay, to God. So, um, if I'm on. T- this is violated. regular on top or like reverse cowgirl? No, if you if you ride him uh-huh. and then you put your legs outside of his legs and put his legs up, his dick's still back here, but his legs up. 
and you ride home. It's a thing. You, that's that. That's like it's gonna look like you 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 giving him the power drive. When they when they want you to do all these moves, then you gotta make sure you I, are Mr. showing him how it's it feels. We tell you, you moving. You guys need a forehead. Give me the forehead then. Exactly. Okay. Shut your ass up. He like this. He like this. <laughs> yeah, y'all know reverse cowgirl as as studies has put out is the most dangerous position for what sex. And What's gonna happen? You gonna die? Black. I got I got articles. New York Post. What would happen in reverse? Oh no! Cowgirl? Somebody broke his dick off, off of it. Ooh. He broke his dick. When they must see. have been a big dick because right. a small dick would probably just fall out the pussy. It wouldn't have just broke. Oh, okay. so it'd be a long one. Hold on. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, no, nah, I got this right here. Let me pull this shit up. Great. <laughs> right, like Ben, real bad. Yeah, no, Dennis oh, Rodman talked about him um, breaking his dick a couple times. Hmm. Who? Dennis Rodman talks about it. Really? He broke his dick like two times. He said. I like he'll do he anything. Blood, you know. blood and everything. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna vomit. Uh, oh shit! You're like a sexy teacher. I Thank like this jazz. You. I love this what? for you. Oh, her. Oh, yeah. Just so I can yeah. see teacher. from a distance. Black, you got it. There we go. Yep. All right, yeah. Man breaks his penis performing the world's most dangerous position. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I'm Wait. not making this shit up. <laughs> it is the reverse cowgirl. So yeah, yeah, broke his dick. That's wow. Yeah, he's in here to go do emergency surgery. He called it, left him with eggplant, a word huh? I can't pronounce. <laughs> they ain't call it eggplant. Yeah, left him no with an eggplant. Plant. It's like uh, an Indonesian man had to undergo emergency sur- surgery after refracturing his penis while performing the notoriously risky position. And that was reverse cowgirl. Indonesian man? Indonesian man. I just, okay. Here we go. <laughs> I'm not going, okay. Fractured his penis. Wow. Yeah, after rush to the hospital, the patient told the dogs he heard a loud popping sound. Ooh. And while having oh several, sex for several hours, the woman's on top of the man faces the other way from her partner. Thirty-seven year old, he was thirty-seven. Damn, I'm close to that. Right. <laughs> yeah. But the problem is, where's the woman at? She should be having a million followers right now. This bitch broke a nigga dick. A million like, followers. Why she dicks? not popping right now? Yes. No, I'm not. I don't want to fuck a bitch that break dicks. Her. Why? She obviously got some moves. She breaking dicks. Yeah, that's kind of lit. I like my dick. <laughs> I that's want to live. They're breaking. I don't it. know about that. You want to break dicks? I mean, they want to break our hearts. Look, okay, look here, look here. I'm just saying. That, that? that is just an emotional feeling. I'm like, just you, saying. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, that's just an emotional feeling. Yeah. I don't know who she is though. That's crazy. That was a hell of a move. So you are you still doing the move? <laughs> well, you still letting somebody? Oh, I don't like reverse, me? reverse cowgirl ain't my shit. No, wow. Oh, I enjoy it. It's the easiest position to me. If yeah. you like it, that's mm-hmm. cool, but I don't I, I don't like it. You don't want to put your hands up and help him? Isn't no. that kind of sexy? I mean, even if she's doing regular cowgirl, I'm already grabbing her waist and making her... Okay. I, like, she's like, oh, I'm tired. Don't worry. Let me shoot the muscles. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> up and down. The manual. That's called the manual. The manual? Yeah, you, you got to help him do it. Yeah, right? I got you. There ain't, ain't no problem, baby. You, you know what I'm saying? You clap somebody like, say less. <laughs> I hold you by the waist and just... You got it. You gonna keep popping. So, Jazz, you got mega knees because you said it's the easiest position for you. Yeah, it's facts. easiest. All you have to do is just drop your booty. Like, you can just focus on something else. If See, the TV's on. Lazy fuck. She said, focus on the spot of the wall and go. Yeah. Like, she over there watching Real Housewives. <laughs> I really do. She's going. I so really, really, really do be watching Real Housewives for <laughs> seven And so. I can't judge her because I will be having sex watching The Office. You what? Yeah. I love The Office. Yeah. I will have The Office on. I'm just like, I'm just knocking shit down. It's like, this nigga's hilarious. So y'all into quiet sex, it sounds like. No. No. Loud no. sex, but the TV's up. Y'all are wild. Mm-hmm. The TV's up, it's popping, and I'm going to talk <laughs> shit. Why you laughing at the office? I don't think like, I've ever had sex without the TV on. on. Seriously? Yeah. I can't have sex real. with TV Me on. Me and Jazz are, are soulmates that are never going to be soulmates. It sounds like You are like podcast soulmates. It sounds, you know, I call, I call my, my followers soulies because so, it's like for soulmates. Yeah. Like somebody yeah. you meet that's like my soulie. Yeah, so y'all are crazy. Y'all soulies. That's so yeah, crazy. I, the TV's going to be on. It's really? not, yeah. not going to be... It's going to be... It's gonna, the lights are off. It's going to be some type of light in the room. I can't have sex with the TV on. I'm going to be distracted. Really? I want oh, real to have real good, nasty sex. Hear me out. Each hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. Toilet tissue. If I can, which they heard that, that if I can <laughs> get you not to focus on TV, that means I'm doing my thing. Yes, exactly. So that's the goal. Yeah, but exactly. it, you don't, exactly. like you don't put on something you want to actively watch. Yeah, you turn like an Am Sala movie on. Yeah, or like that. Oh my god, I love my it. favorite. Me too. Like, like it's good enough that like it's, it's cool, but it's it's not as good enough like. Do we really need to know the end? Is it like elevator music? Like yes, actually. Like you turn on Grown Ups one or two. 
Oh yeah, for sure. That's a good movie to have. It's like, it's like nigga, do we really care what happens? <laughs> no. Bad Boys yeah, Two Eva. is one of my like go to. Bad Boys. It's not an action movie. Yeah. Having movie. sex and it's not an no. action. Shit blowing up. Come yeah, on, Jazz. You, you turn yeah, on Bad Boys exactly. Two. I'm like. Chad is crazy it's like, a background movie a girl turned on innocent. bad boys too when I'm in the house and she started trying to club like, chill chill they, they about to blow the nigga up right now no <laughs> like, I'm watching this <laughs> I'm but watching I feel like if too. baseball is on, my pussy getting dry. I, I can't like have Whoa. baseball on. But baseball is so quiet. I it's feel so like boring. now I'm just, yes, I'm just like mm. drying Baseball's up. on my pussy getting dry. Nigga. That's just boring <laughs> shit. I got to go Seriously. to the game. <laughs> At the game is cool. So I would not have sex to sports because men get too distracted. That's very true. Yeah. I That's very to, true. I used to have sex. <sighs> so if we want to know now, too late. You got to say it now. You said sports. <laughs> I would have Lamar Jackson highlights playing in the background. That would get you kicked out the bedroom. I'm a, I'm, I'm a Baltimore Ravens fan. Are you? I got season tickets. And like, I would have the recap. If we won the game, I would have the recap. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the highlights. I do it. <laughs> I don't like, want to have sex. We won the game today. No, I'll come, I can't. I'll come, I'll come out to the, I'll come out the crib. It's Larry Dick time. Came for the game. We won. I don't want to do that. Turn, turn on ESPN. They're going to talk about us. They're going to talk about us. Now we're talking about sex. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I would definitely play I would definitely play highlights of the game. That is wild, Walt. That's how I missed the Lamar Jackson spin move against the Bengals because I was having sex and I had to clean myself off because somebody <laughs> wanted to have sex while Lamar Jackson. They blowing them out anyway. Well, okay. question, because you just said something. Do you want, if you had sex with somebody that wasn't your woman or whatever, you wasn't in a relationship right now, you wouldn't get you a hot towel after sex if you at her house or get you, throw you a t-shirt? <laughs> Not going to hold you? A t-shirt? Crazy. A t -shirt. Not going to hold you. Both will suffice. I'm good. I got mine. Really? See, I always do a hot towel. <laughs> I try to be nice, right? That's nice. That do, would be, that I, would I try be, to wipe them. Do you that wipe would be go, that I would do be a wipe too. I ain't going to hold you because all the disgusting things I make... Women do her sex. <laughs> At least you once, can I, once I once I nut like yeah, get off me. Yeah. <laughs> you are, yeah, you're, you're, you, you're a nasty woman. <laughs> and you told me to do it. I don't care, nasty ass. The fuck off. That's me. a real no. thing, Walt. That's a real thing. Post not clear. Men, yeah, men want you to do the worst shit ever, and afterwards they be judging you. Yeah. I don't judge. I just be like, she's like, you fucking like, judge. I'm like, you know, when you nut, and they be like, they be still, y'all. That's a day, y'all. Because I'm pretty sure y'all have done it. And nigga, uh, nigga with nut, and you like, oh, I'm just gonna keep doing some nasty thing to him while he's coming. Like, y'all yeah. hate that? Get off me. Y'all hate that? Like, I'm, I'm, it's, it's, come, it's come on me. On my hands and stuff, <laughs> it's sticky. <laughs> and it's like, you know me. So don't, so don't touch you no more. You done? I'll like, like, I'll be, I'll be nothing. Come and lick my nipple. Like, what you doing? What you doing? I'm done. <laughs> you not like, activated no more. No, like, give me, give me, give me five really? minutes. Give me five, ten minutes. Yeah. We can get back to that. But right now, I'm discussing everything we yeah. just did. Like, don't make me come from head before we have sex. And uh, be, really? You're, you tap out. I'm yes. disgusted with you. Yes. And I don't want to be touched. Like, my butt. Like, don't touch my nipples. Don't touch yes. anything. Don't rub my butt. Don't do ink. Just please. Yes. Agree. Allow me to lay here quietly, please. Agree. So that's all I want. Yeah. Huh. I've never. I mean, certain, the certain women I deal with, uh, in my opinion, y'all, they're very different. Right. Like, so I was like, yeah, they, I want to make sure they come off head, especially if I knew I, I just mm -hmm. hey, look, yeah, I ain't jerked off in three days. And you about to quick, come in four minutes. One. Yeah. So well, <laughs> you're, 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 a please, you're a pleaser. Oh, yes. Oh, that's dope. Oh, uh, Most men are not pleasers, I feel like. Um, I've heard that a lot of men just use women as like live masturbators. Oh, like they wow. just, they times. just, they just fuck so they don't have to beat off. I'm like, she, just, ain't, she ain't that pretty, yeah. but you know. They'll just use a woman's Got body to see to it come. through, my boy. This yeah. is wild. Yeah. No, I feel like I haven't. I had my first orgasm was through myself. No, okay. it wasn't. For, it wasn't from a man, of course. Yeah. But it was years later in life, like in my twenties. Mm -hmm. So yes, yeah, so I had my first orgasm when I was like twenty something. So now when it's time to have sex, I'm gonna have my orgasm. I don't care what's going on. Like, right. I'm not letting you come unless yeah. I come. I'm not faking it. I, I don't want That's anyone good. to fake it. I hate people. Definitely. You know, like I need. Yeah, I, I need to really have like. Good sex. I don't fake it. I don't. I and I would definitely yes. like, like. She just out there acting, what? screaming loud. Like, bitch, my dick ain't that big. <laughs> uh, I know what's going on. Right. I got oh, like, like you're doing. I'm not. Too in your, much. I'm not. Yeah. I know I'm not in your stomach. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Relax. Yes. The hand, the hand pushback. Like, like, you, like, no, cool yeah. out. Oh, the pushback is lit. I'm cool with that. Okay, well, my bad. I know. I'm cool. That means that's that'd be legit. But like. To act like you're having a fucking aneurysm while I'm fucking like, okay, you look just. <laughs> it's crazy. I, I don't need your acting skills, fucking Angela Bassett, but you're good. Oh my. Yeah, I'm not faking it no more. I'm going to be like serious, serious about orgasm. I'm not going to like fake it. No and point. I also demand like head too. Like I just got to try. Yeah, I just tried to. He tried to have sex with me and he was like, 
So for me, I can't kiss everybody. No. And a lot no. of men aren't good kissers. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, yeah, no, don't do not do that. And I also don't like my neck or ears being lit. Yes. Oh, oh, that's that's weird. weird. I don't like that's it. That's high schoolish. Oh, like, stop. exactly. So I'm like, me either. Ugh. That's weird. So I don't like, ki- I like so though. don't slob all over me. So he's trying to do that. And I'm like, just, and he was like, oh, uh, uh, I was like, uh, uh, uh. Yes. Are you crazy? I'm not crazy with head. I'm good with not having head. Like, cause sometimes men just fuck mind. it up too much. Wait, what? So, what, what if he, you were kissing and he just pulled a titty out? His titty? Huh? Your titty. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, like he, she said, she don't like the neck and, and the Mm-mm. ears. I'm like, so uh, I'm kissing like, titties out now. You could go to my titties for like, sure. No, yeah, take the shirt off. You, you have like a motherfucking I like that <laughs> red skin shirt. Like, put the, put this up, what? titties out. I don't want a red skin shirt. Why like, red skin? I don't know. I can't think of nothing else. <laughs> yeah, I usually, you know, I like to wear my little robe and my little outfit in the house. Oh, I'm talking about if y'all like you dropping them off at like I don't know, or he got in your car. Are you having car sex, Jazz? I am so confused by this scenario. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I, how did we get here? If oh, a man oh, is in my car trying to oh, kiss oh, me. Oh, you in his car and he's kissing you and he's like, you're just going to Oh, like a make out session yeah. in the car. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That context was important because it, it kind of felt. Um, yeah, I wouldn't really do a make out session in the car because a lot of y'all niggas can't kiss. Yes. It's a turn off. I think, it's I do, I think I'm a decent kisser. See, I, yeah, I mean, I don't know. We got, use a lot of spit we got a couple tongue. of guys in the in the crowd. Y'all feel like y'all decent kisses out here and shit. Y'all get <laughs> shitty. Oh, that shitty. is very honest, and I love it because men are gonna say we great at everything. Black, right? hurry up and put his thumb up. I know that's right. You can kiss a black. I know. Let's kiss him. Well, well, I one well, one because I think I'm a decent kisser because one back in my day before I knew about Doctor Uma, I kissed a couple of white bitches and. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, they 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 they're notorious kissers. <laughs> they, they do kiss, like making out. They, they love, they love, they love making out. Yeah. Yeah. They love it. White yes. <laughs> Whenever I'm in a white club or bar, they just be making out. Yes. And I'm like, why are y'all in here they be kissing? Maybe Taylor Swift playing in the background. Yeah. They just yeah. going at it. Have you kissed a white man before? I, I've dated a white guy. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Is it a difference with kissing a white man versus a black man? I do think so. What is it? Better? It was, it, yeah. It, it more passionate? More or passionate. Just, okay, yep. okay. Because yep. in my mind, if you kiss good, I'm like, okay, the sex is going to be great. That's not always true. It's not always true. That is I, I mean, not as always a man, true. As a man, okay, y'all coming from a woman to yes, a man. I'm thinking right. from a man, I mean, a, a woman coming to a man. Like, I'm thinking like, okay, a woman coming up to me, she could kiss good. Like, oh, it's going to be lit. We got chemistry. We got good chemistry. I do think Passion. if a man kiss good, mm-hmm. he pussy good, though. I agree with that. I think for sure. Yeah. I don't, I've never met a man who kissed good and ate pussy bad. Agree. You know, lips so, is lips. So you like, agree. <laughs> At this point, like, what's well, up? I agree. Add that to the board. Because <laughs> lips is lips. <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one. But yeah, no, okay. So now, we don't went through this. It's time to get to our point. Jazz, you already know where we're going. We might, <laughs> we might, like, start, we might as well pull her up. Uh, yeah, oh, yeah, learn. does everyone need a refresher? I still have a lot. Yeah. You still I have, have a lot, yeah. Okay, because okay, it's well, time bottle, for Look at the bottle, boy. Your, Look at thank you. Pass it over. Look at um, we do we do a, we do something we call. What? I'm good. I'm yeah, good. I was I'm good. I'm good. I, got, I got you in here. Okay. I'm good. I don't think so. We have a game okay. that we do. That's true. Uh, what? Oh my God, I do all the wild news after this. We have a game that we do, and we call this. And Jazz one day is going to join me. What's? Yeah, I know. Truth or shots. Yeah, shot, shot. And what we're going to do is, gonna, okay. yeah, what we do is ask a bunch of our questions that people see go viral and things of that nature, which is more so in sexual based. Okay. And that's why we come up with our sex humor. So Jazz only pops off with a question that Lauren Lionel brought to this podcast yeah. when they joined us. Literally, actually, Lauren, it's been a fucking year. This is a year. You came in April. That's crazy. <laughs> it's been a fucking year, yo. And you put your daughter here now, like. No, he, <laughs> he put his daughter here now. <laughs> Yes, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> he, went, he came out here and brought each. I was like, "Hey, look, we got, we got to make this an anniversary. Like, we're gonna block off a week, uh, two Every weekends. April. I think so. For, yeah, for learn line to come yeah, back yeah. to DC. That's fair. And each to come back to DC yes. and fuck with us every year, in April, bro. Yeah. Yes. That's real. We yeah. love it. Yeah. Look, so but they brought this. They brought this topic up okay. and we ran with it and it kind of gave yeah, us great content. Shout out to Learn Lionel yeah. for yeah. that. That was that was yeah, good. I don't hate. I'm not. I'm not here when somebody brings us a good a good fucking segment or content or something like that. I. 
Hey, we got it from them. Yes, that's lit. But we running with it. Yes, that's right. It's ours <laughs> now. It's ours <laughs> now. Sorry, Jazz. Let's <laughs> well, start it off. Okay, so our first question that we'd like to warm up with is... Wait, Jazz, I'm sorry. So if I if it's true, take a shot? No, if it's if you want to tell the truth... If you want to answer, answer. answer it. If, if you not, don't want to, take a, take a shot. Okay, got yeah. it. All right, I'm here. I'm ready. So what <clears throat> is your go-to porn category? Oh my God, Deep Throat. I love Deep Throat. I enjoy watching like women, like Deep Throat men. That's like... And gag and spit. Oh, I love that. So we found out about this category Topic, through category, my guy genre. Terry Goofy, um, was a comedian out here. He called it was a DS dick sucking lips and facial. So I DS, saw that. Yeah, mm, I saw it. I saw the. We, I didn't know about it, and I, I mean I've been enjoying it since then. <laughs> um, there's been a couple of them that seen that clip and follow us now. Shout yes. out to y'all. Shout out to y'all. And they were like, hey, hey, hey Walt, send me. D- this the only fans. Like, I'm, I'm gonna check it out. <laughs> I was, I, was on house, I was on house arrest. <laughs> it, was, it was jack all central. They found our clip and then they they started interacting with the clip, that community. So yes. we get a lot of... Um, so I was like, oh, this is... I, I was like, and mm-hmm. one girl sent me one of her clips and I was like, you do a good job. <laughs> I, gave, I gave her props. I was like, I sent her DM back like, you do good work. Oh my gosh, no. <laughs> that was it. It's like, I want to be on the podcast. Like, maybe, I don't know, but... <laughs> so do you, do you like giving head? What is it about watching it that makes you like... I, I honestly think that I, I I give the best head in the world. I, I international. I don't know. I feel okay. like now I, I got really good. Now I, I was gonna say now, now now we see why you get a bunch of dicks in your DM. That's probably why, right? But I don't know. I'm, I'm not sucking any dick, of course not. But like I I think I give good head. So watching, give me give I me some tips. Learn. Give me like your go to like what's your go to oh, move? Okay, so first when you first take his dick out, you yeah. want to rub it. Okay. But you don't want to lick the tip of. You want to lick around the bottom. No one licks the bottom of the dick. The it's always dry. Really? Yeah, right. You want to lick down there first, right? That's creative. Get it, get it wet, right? Mm-hmm. And you want to kind of like lick around there, work it up, and then you want to put it in your mouth and just mm-hmm. hold it for a second, like a plank. Okay. You want to plank the dick, right? Like a popsicle. Yes. And then okay. you want to go all the way down as far as you can. Okay. Now, if his dick is big, that's cute because it's like you're going to gag on the magnet. But if it's a small dick, put it's it in your fine. mouth and wash machine. Fun. Yeah. 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 You know I mean, and you kind of like gargle it a little bit. They go crazy over that shit. I love so it. Starting from the bottom. Am I too detailed? Oh my no. god! She's taking, not lying, I'm, right? Now. I'm taking. That's, that sounds like some good time right there. The note. And, the, and the, you know, of course, it's all about keeping your mouth wet. Like you know. Yeah, I think Jazz, uh, jazz might need some tips. Mm-hmm. Jazz, you don't enjoy like giving hair. I'm always looking for pointers. Yeah, yeah. No, because she she doesn't want to do it. No. She I, says somebody I enjoy sleep, doing it. No, 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 no. You don't he have to ask me. If I love you, if I like you, drunk. you don't have to ask. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So more the base, because I usually do pull out and I do start the tip, but I'll yeah. start the base and go up, 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 yes. up, up. Yes. And then just put it in and hold. Yes. Like a plank. Yes. Because that's kind of like the anticipation part mm-hmm. too. Okay. Yep. So just hold it. And it helps you get like bills spit up too mm. when you're just holding it. Yeah. That's the other thing. I don't smoke anymore, but my mouth used to be dry. Listen, I spoke about that. I don't. I'm not. I don't really smoke. But if I have a guy I deal with. He smokes. You yeah. know, for the vibe. I'll maybe yeah, smoke with him. Yeah, puff. But that's the worst thing because you try to smoke somebody's dick and your mouth dry. Yeah, that shit is weird. It's very. It's like, it's like sucking on a a piece of uh, wood. It's just like chewing. Like you know when you have like a piece of steak that got a little gristle and you yes. just chew and chew and chew and chew and it's not going nowhere. It's just like it's just. It's not, nothing's it's happening. Not gonna work. Nothing's yes. happening. Yeah. Nothing's moving. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's a good tip. Yeah. That's a good you're tip. You're welcome. Yes. <laughs> I had someone in my OnlyFans this week ask me for a head head video. Really? What? The yeah. F- Jess. Yeah. Really? No. Yeah. There's no way. Oh, about yeah. We're, we're There's stopping no you way. at that. Happen, yeah. right. We're stopping There's you right. at that. You guys, enough is enough. <laughs> have, yeah. My followers have gone up. Yeah, my followers have gone up. <laughs> and then the person was like, oh, I DM'd you on um, oh, IG and you, know. and you never respond. I guess this is a platform. I'm like, yeah, nigga. <laughs> like, like, no. <laughs> this is how, yes. No. Pay your little subscription buddy and I will respond <laughs> to your DM. But he was like, oh, I'm trying to get head videos. And I was like, oh, you have the Absolutely wrong not. account. Absolutely not. Absolutely yes. wrong account for that. Sorry. Yeah, you're, you're not you're getting that. Say, I will I will I will give you a stern talking to you. <laughs> you <laughs> come out sucking office. dick on OnlyFans. There ain't no way. There ain't no way. I would fight myself. Yeah, y'all don't have to worry about getting that from me on the internet. Y'all yeah, crazy but I was say that. now I was like, no what? We, we gonna we gonna, we gonna corrupt you on tequila yes, talk. Yes, <laughs> we no. gonna corrupt you. Yes, and, and now y'all here sucking dick. No, 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 no. <laughs> Only no. fans. There ain't no way. Then someone asked me for like a guy I was talking to. He was like, "Well, I'll wear the shiesty mask," and I was like, "Yeah, but 
I hate that. Not no. gonna hold you. That's kind of like my dream scenario. Do like, not do that. Don't if do that. I was in like a porn joint, yeah, I want to wear the shiesty. You watch the guy who be getting his ass ate all the time at the shiesty what on. What the fuck? I'm you telling you, he has a million you pornos on. Listen, he has a million pornos, right? He owes the shiesty Our on. Producer is a sicko. And you, what? Yes, it's he gets his ass ate multiple it. different on, girls. No, no, no. What was it What's called? the name of it? Dick Drainers. Yes. You know about that? Yes. You don't get no bitches. <laughs> 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 okay, fair. How you know fair. these names? It's crazy. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, so don't do that. Because I always get his vibe when I hear about Shacey in a porno. Yeah, okay. Yeah. But all of that to say, I'm so, I, OnlyFans, you will get a little titty. Yes. You will get a little nipple. Mm-hmm. You, get, you definitely get some ass, but you will not be getting any active sexual. Jazz and giving head on camera. Fuck no. Yeah, I get it. Sure. Crazy as hell. What's the pettiest thing you go to somebody for? Hmm. Oh my gosh. Um, I went on a date and a guy, we we got to the restaurant. We met at the restaurant. He okay. went in the restaurant without me. And when we got when he got there, he texted me and said, do you have Apple Pay? And I was like, yeah. He's like, all right, I'm going to send you money because I left my wallet at home. That sounds considerate. <laughs> so yeah. after we date, we went to the date or whatever, I yeah. didn't talk to him again. Why? What the fuck? Okay, that is really petty. I just, I don't know. It just was, I feel like. You think that's not petty? He's not responsible. How you leave your wallet at home? He left his wallet, but he first, had money. He said, I will send date. you the money. Yes, it's a first date. And I think more so because he left me outside. What if I got kidnapped? Mm. What if somebody got me? You could have waited in your car for me to get there and walk in together. He went and sat mm-hmm. down and did everything without me. So it was it was it was a mm. lot. Well, okay, okay. Hear me out. Okay. Hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. Mm-hmm. First date, mm-hmm. he got there early. He got there on time. <laughs> so you were late, <laughs> like two minutes. No, it wasn't a long wait. <laughs> it was like two minutes. Well, I'm always late. You, hello, I came here today. I'm no. just saying, <laughs> if you late, I'm not wait. I'm yeah, I'm gonna get a table. I'm, get t- I'm getting a table. I'm gonna get out first round of drinks or whatever. No, you can't order drinks before I get to the table because then yes. you roofie me. Yes, That's a good point. That's a good point. you definitely yeah. roofie me. Yeah. That's a good point. Yeah. Well, I will get my drink. <laughs> yeah, you can go ahead and get started. <laughs> no, that's worse. You want me to drink without me? Yeah, I'm that's like, oh, actually bad. Because yes. then I'm gonna think you have an alcohol problem that you couldn't wait four minutes for me to come sit down at the table. And then we're going to a meeting after the date. Like, yeah. no, what? Like, no. seriously? But that didn't happen to me once. A like, guy did forget his wallet. But we have been dating for a while. That's different. Yeah, you know? and he cashed at it, me like, like I mean, right away. I, I would understood it if you said the guy forgot his wallet and he asked you to pay. But if he sent you the bread, he it's sent all the good. money. But it's a turn off when there's other men. We was at like a bar. Like mm. restaurant was the bar. It was other men sitting there and seeing me pull my card out and pay for the date. When he's, I could see that. That's not attractive. I could see that. Really? It's our first date. If you're my man, I don't care about nobody else, you know, sitting around. Yeah. But I'm actively single ready to mingle. So I might be looking at the other guy across the bar and I got to pay for our date too. That's too much. No. Hey, no, look. No, no, no. That shows you boss. <laughs> men, women don't want to be boss they don't. all the time we do it because we have to do it exactly. not because we want to do it you know like I don't want to we live very leave. exhausting bossy yes. lives in our I dating life we don't want to be boss if I paid for it I sent you the bread thank you it, I don't think it matters that you that shows my life with you it, 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 that showed me a, 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 I went like Raymond Simone glimpse into 10 years <laughs> like this nigga is irresponsible bitch leave him now I'm an irresponsible. <laughs> he can't bring his fucking wallet. Don't even do it. Okay, Nigga, I, that's I, fair. I, I went to get my anchor monitor cut off and I forgot to charge it. Like, yeah. So bring back the charger when you can. <laughs> you better put it. You. you better put it. You better mail it to them. Don't you go back up there? They was like, yeah, right. whenever you can, just drop yeah. it off. Oh, right, I got you. Oh, you're crazy. Just put it in the mail. Put it FedEx. Crazy. Right. It's, it's down. Well, mail, it's down the. Sh- it's twenty uh, minutes away. Say that six. Yeah, I I'll just know. drive it over there. I'll, I'll get somebody to drive me over there. I'm just saying, get somebody to drive you over there. Give it to Don't see you ever again. Ever. You were too excited. You forgot. I, I, yeah. And he was too excited to get in that pussy. And he forgot to bring the wallet. <laughs> and he ain't getting no pussy Damn. for that reason. Damn. That's wild. I was just. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, go ahead, Jazz. Um. If you don't see the list, I go ahead go. Yeah, I don't have my. I'm sorry, I don't have my notes out. If Let you could pick a notes. threesome with a couple, who would you pick? Oh, that's a good one. <gasps> oh, um, right now it would be Lori Harvey. And uh, Dan- the Dan- Snowfall Dan- guy. Dan- yes. Dan- yes. Dan- 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 Idris. Yes. Yeah. Idris. 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 Yes. Idris. Definitely not. I mean, Laura Harvey, Harvey is the prettiest she's brown pretty. bitch on earth right now. She's very You know, pretty. and then she yeah. got this nigga that's like. Very handsome. Yes. Chocolate. Mm-hmm. That's what was funny. Nice teeth. Because mm-hmm. my little brother, and I hope he comes to the podcast. Shout out to you. Mm-hmm. Um, my, my little brother went to this joint in uh, Cancun. It was like a, it was like a week. They, there's like a party I forgot the name of it but like people from Baltimore everyone goes out there and it's like parties from 
24 hours. Oh, wow. Like Quicksilver DJ's there, all that shit. So it was like, he was there, and he's like, yeah. He got a picture with old boy. He's like, yeah, that nigga, from, it was season one, though. He was uh, like, he was new. He was like, yeah, it's that boy from Snowfall. Like, yeah, we hanging out with him. Like, what the fuck you hanging out with? He's like, yeah, he's trying to find bitches. Like, so oh. he wasn't even getting the attention. Oh, no. He's getting he now. So he was trying to grab, he was trying to figure, like, yeah. put his yeah. work in. He, put, he was putting his work in out yeah. there with my brother and my niggas from Queens. And so <laughs> oh, now to see that. how the motherfuckers, like, now I'm seeing, like, every girl's like, yo, yes. hell. Yes. Like, yeah. it's, it's he didn't, he did, his looks didn't change. He didn't get slowed up. Money make he didn't you get look good. <laughs> Money make you beautiful. Money give you confidence. I think that confidence make your shoulders, you know, sit up a little bit more. I was gonna say, there ain't that's no that's such thing as a what Jay Z say, no such thing as an ugly millionaire. Hell yeah, that's true, Jazz. That's I have that. not seen one rich nigga that's not handsome in yeah. some way. Yeah, that's true. Pee wee long way. Who? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Who? <laughs> Who? 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 Who's that? I don't know who that is. I'm going to beat that out because I don't want to get shot. Who is he? He's a rapper from Atlanta. I don't want to get shot. Really I got to be in Atlanta next week. Let me beat this out. Say the name. Say the name again, Jazz. Tom, say that shit. Say the name again. Yes, I want to see Jazz because I'm like, who? We. I'm going to put it on the screen. I'm going to put it on the screen. Pee Wee Longway. <laughs> he is a millionaire. She was like, uh-uh, I know you don't want him, girl. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he, okay. He, got, he, made the he is a millionaire. He gave me the ball from uh, ATL. Uh, yeah, I know who you're talking about, but I think he, he, he looks way better. He's look way better? Yeah. Okay. Wait. Okay. This is not positive. Oh no! Okay, yeah. yeah. No, no, no. Is, no, no, no. I, I really don't want problems. Jay Z, I'm, I'm pussy. Us now. I'm, 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 I'm not gay. <laughs> <laughs> and we ain't trying to get smoked next week. Seriously, no, I, we I don't want to die. Before. I'm not trying to get smoked oh, next week. God. I didn't okay. say Pee Wee. I don't want to die That's over jokes. That's the filter on that one, then. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Black, yeah. don't put this on the the, the 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 whole the show. Don't put this on the yeah. show. Yeah. I think of another one. Kodak Black That's is a handsome. Kodak Black get bitches. But he's not handsome. <laughs> okay. Yeah. He's but he's handsome. a mean, eh? Yeah. yeah. Technically. Yeah, that's true. Uh, okay. Well, that's... um. Huh. <laughs> wow. Okay. Okay. Hey, he wasn't lying. Jay Z was wrong. Yeah. For the nope. first time that's ever. That's why I'm not paying. That's why I'm not taking the uh, the the dinner over Jay with Jay Z over five hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Tell me some bullshit like that and lie. Motherfucking <laughs> AC Green was a millionaire. You're saying names. Hold on, let me go. I know who AC. Yeah, yeah. like who AC Green? I'm looking like I'm trying to think. AC like, yeah. Green. <laughs> you know him. AC Black Black Green. Black. I don't know him. <laughs> oh, he's not bad. Let me see him. AC Green, we long way? No. AC Green. <laughs> he was bad about that Y'all know that how many what? NBA players out here ugly as fuck? Yeah. Just, if he were to get a better haircut, he'd be okay. Oh, yeah, okay. Not that one. Yeah. No. Tony Snip. Nope. Shout out to my boy. Uh, uh, <laughs> Stupid. Shout out to my boy Alex. He played in the NFL for years. Rookie year, they have a symposium, and they say, hey, look here. When you walk out of here and you get your contracts, you ain't look no better. You look yeah. the same way you did when you walked in here. That's a lie. Dude, that is look, a lie. That's a real. Because they all because you want to get all this attention from all these women. Yeah. You don't look no better. You look the same way you did when oh, you walked okay. in here. Yeah. To tell him yeah, to like, know, like yeah. yourself. They gonna see you yeah. different. But you don't look different. Yeah. That you ain't. Yeah. You were yeah. the same nigga. Yeah. That's yeah. true. Stop. <laughs> Bruh. Come on now. I see. I remember it said my man. I remember said say the entertainer took my man's girl at, at love back in the day. Cedric the Entertainer? That's wild. <laughs> wow. So he That's said he came wild. in the club and took my man's girl from the table. It was wild. Yeah, but Cedric the Entertainer. Uh, this no. Was, this yeah. was 2009? That's weird. Yeah, That's, That's wild. not. Yeah. You, He's not Your girl with the fuck Cedric the Entertainer, mm -hmm. nigga. That is wild. Shout out yeah. to you too, Cedric. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. for that one. He's not that. Oh, he was old head back then. Yeah, he's still old head. He, he had more of old head. I was gonna 24 say, year old. is he yes. no older than old head? That's Damn. actually pimping. I like that. Hell yeah, I like that. All right, Jazz. Yes. Oh, you ain't got to do. Oh, you, you really didn't look at the list. No, nope. you just Hold on, ain't let me doing pull no up one. My notes. I, I gotta put my glasses back. Okay, let me get let me get to it again. <laughs> All right, mm. now, Scared. what's your least favorite form of foreplay? Oh, um, super shot. Oh, no, I can say it. I hate when somebody try to rub my pussy. Don't rub my rub pussy. It? Oh, so, I love the rub. I don't yeah, want so, the like, rub. if you give him a head and he's reaching over and play I with it. I feel like I like niggas that use their hands a lot. They having their calluses in their hands. 
Oh. I don't want a rough ass rub. My, don't rub my pussy. Oh, see, head. I love the hands. rub. I love the rub. The but rub. like niggas be like built a house. I like love like, the rub. Name no. the podcast. Yeah, I love the rub. Ask I don't the want the calluses though. <laughs> yeah, I love the rub. Yeah, so no. I don't know if I've ever had. I mean, I'm sure I've dealt with a man who has like rough. Um, or callous but so I don't know nets, like they said back in the day I don't know if I've ever like been able to feel it down there cause some men try to do the new like before back in the day you rub pussy with two fingers and they try to do like the, the pussy grip like the pussy grip they be doing all this stuff that. you be like calm down never like, did don't grab grip. my pussy like don't do that no I do well, know Donald sometimes do, do what grab one by the pussy <laughs> Don't don't laugh. <laughs> that don't was laugh. a good one. Come on, don't know. Don't laugh at him. It's not wrong with what? It's not wrong with him. He said, "I grab him by the pussy." Don't laugh. <laughs> grab by the pussy. <laughs> yeah. So I've never. Like, I have seen guys had guys be a little aggressive with the yes. fingering, where it's like they are digging, and you're like, "Hey, yeah. hey, hey, gentle." gentle gentle like yeah. you don't have to dig a hold of china in there i promise you like just a, a, a softer touch goes a long way hell yeah and you trying yeah. to jam your fingers in as hard and deep as possible it does not feel good yeah and don't try to do the one two four of me like one two their four fingers Ooh. like don't do that like oh so, what, baby don't do y'all niggas different in philly yeah, they, they, they hit like, you with the hong 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 i don't want that you know what i'm saying like, i don't, don't know if i've ever had I, I don't like the pussy rub shit four Just keep fingers yourself. in that's a lot i've they had a girl tell me put shit. a fist in before did you do it fuck yeah <laughs> fisting that's did what it it's called huh did it go in i didn't have sex with it but it went in he was stretched out of shape i said it's gonna feel like a donut thrown in the hallway no, a hot dog. A hot dog, yeah, hot dog. Throw yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. I understood you all. Hey, look, I yeah. understood Dumb. you. Tequila is hitting first day out. I understood you. I understood it. Wait, I've seen the fisting videos, but there isn't no real world scenario that I would ever want your entire fist in my body. Yeah, she's. she's we got to be on like drugs. And I don't fuck, do yeah, drugs. Yeah. We got to be like super heavy like, drugs. We got to be on drugs. drugs for me to be like, come on, fist me. That's yeah, we wild. want cocaine. But look here, yeah, it I was know, like. <laughs> I don't, I don't that would be never. so crazy. Dude, like, no, I'm like, yeah, I'm like, huh. I'm like, my dick is not, <laughs> not today. It's not gonna, it's not gonna work on this one. I, I blo- actually, I didn't, I, I didn't speak to her after that. I, like, I, I can't keep up with you. Baby. Okay, so that brings us to our next question. Mm-hmm. Truth or shot? Okay, tell us a story where a guy was just so nasty you could never fuck with him again. Mm. It was this one guy. Um, we was together around college time, and. Uh, he went away to Texas and he was there at like an all like men's school or boys' school, or whatever. He Dude, came back and we came back. He would always ask him to like put my finger in his ass. Nope. He would always ask during sex. Like he would, whisper, nope. he would whisper it, right? Like put your finger in my ass. So, you know. Not me, whisper. Whisper it, right? Put my like, finger, so I was, put that, yeah. Put that finger in there. He was just like that. The <laughs> <laughs> so, so I was like, I'm like, but me being the freak that I am, because I'm a freak, right? Yeah. I would do it. I'm like, I don't want to. Wait, but so I you would, did it? I did it, right? Mm. But, the, the, you, but he would go you finger pop and assholes farther, out here. Yes. And then one day, he was like, let's go to the um, sex store. Okay. He was trying to buy a dildo. <gasps> yes, that was the end, the end, like, end all be all. Now, I bought the dildo with him with intentions on, you know, pegging him, I guess he wanted. Uh, but I couldn't do it after that. She was going to pull a big dick mic. Yeah. Who big dick Mike? Oh, oh shout, out, shout out to uh, our girl, Steph. Dominatrix Stephanie, that came on the podcast. Okay. She, her first client was a guy named Big Dick Mike, mm-hmm. white boy, white man, older white man, and he picked out his own dildos, and they were like this long, and she had like, every new girl will fuck this nigga for 60 minutes straight, and it was no breathing room. Like she, he went harder, faster, he would do spins, all type of shit on the dildo, and he always picked black dildos. Shut up. Oh. And he wanted the other girls to watch him. Yeah, he wanted the crowd Shut and cheer up. it on. His name was Big Dick Mike. Big Dick Mike. <laughs> I'm just. I, I don't Shout make to Stephanie for the story again because it's so crazy. crazy. He, so you, you were dating the Big Big Dick Mike Jr. Yes, I didn't know. <laughs> I, just, I didn't even know. I didn't even know. So do you feel like if a man wants you to peg him or anal play that that's a line that just automatically is a no for you? I, I, or I just like changes your opinion of him? One hundred percent. I feel mm-hmm. like it's not just me that you you want anymore. I feel mm-hmm. like it's more to it. And maybe I'm wrong, but that's just what I feel. Yeah, I feel I like mean, that's kind of a lot. The politically correct answer would be... Politically correct. You know, I'm, I'm going to learn a little bit. It's cool. Like, the politically correct answer would be like, hey, you're dealing with, doing it with a woman is not yeah. in that type of form. That's the real answer. But yeah. in the streets... 
Be like, hey, a little bit, a little bit more <laughs> sauce on, on it. the block. Is yeah, gonna go a little, a little more sauce on it for real. Like, so yeah, no, that was the end. Of, that was the end of that for me and him. I couldn't do anything. But you did buy the dildo with him. I bought a dildo with How him. How big was it? Out, it was a big one. I think it was a six inch one. <laughs> it's a hot size. dog. It's four inches long, so it was like a sausage. It was big. Yeah, it was like a good width too. So and it was something I would love to have. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So you saying six inches is big? Six inches is a good size. <laughs> we we back in the, we yeah. back in the game, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I don't think yeah. six inches is shrimp. I think six inches is. It's not a shrimp. It's, it's, not a, shrimp. Good, it's a good size. I'm yeah. gonna say it. it's small. It ain't shrimp. It's not. Yeah, yeah it's it not. It's, you can work with six inches. Yeah, six yeah. inches is definitely doable for yeah. sure. I was saying, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't you know, niggas ain't out here like this. Yeah. That's different. Yeah. We, we back, y'all. That's different. <laughs> I'm back in the six city. Six inches is not a strip. A, a shrimp. I'm, and fuck, and I'm and fucking and around, yo. Don't listen to me. I know. It's funny they can see because somebody gonna listen to this like, yeah, you know what? It's six inches. <laughs> they gonna know. They gonna know like, it. <laughs> that's what's gonna happen. Looking, looking at girls like, yeah, you had sex with him and you ain't six right, inches. Right, right. I'm like, damn, man. You, I, I was, you know, this, this is a comedy show. Exactly. <laughs> tell him. Tell him twice. These are jokes, people. Oh, right. man. <laughs> but, um, oh, you, you, oh, goodness, Jess. Come on now. I have to refresh. Sorry, okay. I and I got this bag. so um, Dira can use it as well when she's here. Oh, the mirror. Yeah, because I want to make sure all the girls Thank look you. nice. Yeah. While they're here. All right. Tell Dira that this. True is for sure. sure. If it's something that you could do sexually without no consequences, what would you do? I would do a gangbang. Yeah, here. So whoa, whoa, whoa! Stop. <laughs> What'd you say? No consequences. I would do a gangbang. A lot like of you. You yeah, are the I gang. I want. I want to be with the you, gang. You. So you each you, in the gang. So you join the set. Yeah. Fight I back. I would love to. Do, I would. Yeah. I would. I'm, it's in my head. I wouldn't really do it in real life. You said something I would do. Just no consequences. Yeah. yeah. No consequences. Yeah. I think that's kind of like. I said the, the same whole thing. Crips yeah. just get on you. Not the whole. Not crips. the whole crib. Now you now you cripping. We got five piece. Whoa. On the biscuit. That's 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 that's. that's, that's, that's I'm just saying. That's I, a game. That's, that's not. I, would, I probably would never do it in, in real life. But that's in my reality, I, in my you know fantasy world, yeah. That's that's more than I than I thought. Yeah. No. Three. I mean, wrong with that. I said two. I, I mean, two is a train. Two is a yeah. No, but I would want it to. I would want it to. I would want it to have. I think train energy is a certain energy. Okay, I would want it to have a little bit more threesome energy. That's true. Yeah. You know what? That's no. Now that you said that, yes, that's a good. That's a good point. Because you. you can have train energy and you can have threesome energy. It's threesome energy, energy is like we all in this to get her out Together. the way. Right. Yes. There. Train energy is like nigga high five. We hit the net. Yeah, yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. We got. We, we grab the girl from off the block. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. But a gangbang well. is like a threesome with multiple people. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's that's no. That's doing different positions. You know, it's a lot. Yeah. That's that's, yeah. One, yeah, that's one of my point categories. So I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Gang One second, I would never do it. Mm. Don't be judging me, Jazz. I'm not. I'm just trying to think. <laughs> I just like, can't be in the room with. Mm. So I I never did a threesome with dudes or. Gang I never band. had a threesome. I, uh, uh, I never three, done uh, a lot. I have train. I never. I, yeah, I'm, Pimp C told me if you walking around in another room, fucking on two, uh, you got you and your boy fucking a girl together. He see your dick. Dang, ain't, dang, ain't gangster. I'm like, <laughs> I right, know what Pimp C told me that. I'm a roll with it. <laughs> No, but I feel like men, like y'all play sports. Like that, so. that boy yeah. seen your asshole. That's what he's saying. Okay, no, no. Asshole. Pimp, 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 Asshole's a little different. Pimp, pimp, your boy seen your ass. Mm-hmm. That's, that ain't, that ain't that's gangsta. Different. But I think men see each other's stuff as much as girls see each other's stuff. We yeah. don't. We no? Don't. Yep. We don't. Not even the locker room. That, that whole thing in the locker room that you see in the movies ain't, don't happen. That's not real. It ain't real. <laughs> When back in, even when I was in high school, we shower. I, I put my drawers on in after I was dried off in the shower. Really? Yeah, mm-hmm. We had we had the little covers in the sh- <laughs> Nah, nigga. I do think that's true because I noticed that. Well, sometimes a guy will fall asleep naked, but I do notice that men like do put their underwear back on, where like a girl will fall asleep naked. Secure. Yeah. Right. They don't want to. I feel secure with my underwear on. Yeah. (laughs) Or God forbid something happens in the middle of the night. You don't have to jump up with your dick out to like... Wow. Yeah. Well, that's why I break in. Now I got to fight somebody (laughs) with my dick out. They getting popping. Oh, shit. They getting popping in here. (laughs) Them Latinos will go crazy. (laughs) (laughs) She's not snuggling. Ain't chance to (laughs) hop. 
<laughs> she is crazy. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm so not. Yeah, funny. I'm not coming. No, I just had a visual of like someone breaking in the house and yes. me be like, "Nigga, go downstairs <laughs> and your dick is out." The soft one though. That's the weird part. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Now oh you see my, you see my shrimp. <laughs> He's, he's seen, not even afraid no more. He's, 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 he's seen me on soft. I'm like, yo, like, I'm, now I'm not even threatening. <laughs> he's like, this little nigga. Oh my God. <laughs> like, this ain't my, hey, bro, this ain't my full potential, bro. This ain't my full potential, bro. Like, like, no, no. Nah, nah, and he looking at her different. Like, no, nah, no. Nah, I, I gave her the realness. This, I'm, is, just, this is me. I'm sleeping. This is me scared. <laughs> this is me scared. I'm scared, dick. <laughs> Does it shrink up when you're scared? I know it shrinks yeah, up when you're cold. It shrinks up. Yeah. <laughs> like I said, you ain't you ain't catch me on. Oh, I'm that nigga that you you ain't catch me on off days. I don't oh. run to the bathroom so fast. <laughs> yeah, I <laughs> saw a guy I was dating once. He was asleep, and it was like completely no, like almost like in in. It looked like you know those Greek statues that are no. naked. Oh, the, baby yeah. dicks. the baby dicks. It was I. Well, that's, could, that's a little far. I literally. <laughs> that's a lot. I was staring because I was like, <laughs> Jen, what are you doing? There is nice no dick. way. <laughs> He's a grower, not a shower. But this is Y'all the thing. Crazy. The dick is like average. Hard is average size. It was totally He's a grower, fine. Not a lot. That's a lot. a lot. I could not believe his dick was that small. Sheesh. Like he was really comfortable around you. Hell I was yeah. like. Cause I would put the drawers on fast. <laughs> I Jazz really thought you ain't, you I was looking you ain't at catching me on soft, yeah, baby. Jazz, I thought I was looking at a statue. It was that like that compact. The, the funny thing is, like a little baby carrot. The Aww. most psychopathic yeah. people in the world are the dudes that I've, and I'm not saying they. I've never seen this in my life, but I've, I've had women had this had sent to them. Mm-hmm. The dudes that take a picture of the dick soft and send it to girls. That's weird to me. Yeah, Why I don't do want that? soft. Don't send me no soft dick pics. I need that's a hard like, dick pic. That's psychopathic because you have a lot of confidence for no reason. Mm-mm. I don't why want would you soft send a dick soft pic. dick? That's weird. I, but no why cap. would you show me that? Yeah, and send me a picture with like veins in a dick. I don't want no soft ass picture. Yeah, that's picture weird. Dick. So that's soft. what you want people to send you DMs. I'm no, not. I'm not no. announcing that. Can I get them enough? Hey, I, I, need, I, 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 I got. I make it. I, I got. Saying, I got to. But I'm never. I'm never going to not look. I get them and I send them to my group message. So my friends can see them. Wow. Do y'all yeah. rate them? Yeah. Of course. Y'all know what? You can get money for that. Really? Yeah, they do dick ratings for like twenty dollars on like OnlyFans. <laughs> yeah, on like only I'm about to have an OnlyFans. I'm, I'm dead serious. Oh, like, like girls like, be like on the IG mm-hmm. story on the IG uh, description, like dick ratings twenty dollars. <laughs> Shut <laughs> like, up! It's for men who have a humiliation kink. Yeah. Cool. So they pay. They send you their pic. They send you their picture, right. and then you put you post it on your your feed and be like. Rate this little ass dumbass dick. Shut up. And then they get off from the comments. No, I Shut seen up. one on the Netflix uh, documentary when they the were talking about the, 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 uh, the uh, porn hub shit. Yeah. And then one girl's only fans doing the dick range. She was being like, oh, this is a good dick. She was being yeah. nice. Uh, Nice it depends. Dicks. It depends. Some people aren't nice, and some men are really into being mistreated in the sexual way. Men like that shit, though. Men like when women are aggressive. And exactly. Rude to men them. like being spanked. Yeah, they like, like that shit. Yeah. 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 Verbally spanked. Oh, yeah. Oh, what? Yeah. <laughs> men like that. Y'all I enjoy it. I would never physically Sometimes. spank a man. I'm like that would, would be weird. Sometimes there are times where I felt like I did want to grab a guy's butt. Not not spank me. I'm talking about the words. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, don't yeah. don't touch my butt. There are times where I have wanted to like grab a guy's yeah, butt or give it a little yeah, no, spank, I, that's, but I that's, just have to control myself. Cause my I'm hand, like, my arms move fast. Yeah. I'm like, you're going to ruin the most vibe. Most men want that ass ate, touched, no. everything. I, I, I can't, I haven't been there yet, but most men who I've been with would ask those questions. Yeah, see, hmm. I, I, <laughs> men are freaks. I, yeah. drink, I drink a lot of kale Audience smoothies said, and eat Chipotle. Hmm. I don't think, oh yeah, hell no. I don't, uh-uh, I don't no. want no woman that fuck with me. Uh-uh, Eating that ass. That ass yeah. has been that oh, ass has uh, seen some, uh, some uh, bad like days. Cut, cut. I done shit crazy. Hey. Jess, are we done? Hey. <laughs> Let's just pause right there. Well, she brought it up. Put it on that, me. Put on me. You didn't have to get into it. Just saying. How do you feel about anal pay, play? That's your thing? No. We talked no. about it. Yeah, I'm not an anal, you drunk? anal person. Yeah. I don't like anal. Yeah. I'm talking about for her, not doing to somebody else. Yeah, no. Uh-uh. Mm. I'm not with it. I mean, I feel like if I find a man who's strong enough to lead me, I probably would do almost anything, I think. But yeah. I haven't been there yet. So. I True for sure. Have you thought about somebody else through, during sex? Oh, yes. Oh, hell yeah. I mean. Do shot. Fuck. Oh, <laughs> my bad. I'm going to be no, quiet. No, you would. <laughs> no, yeah. Um, of, of course. I've, you know, when I was with somebody and I was done with them and I knew we were done 
and I wanted to move on because I've never backtracked. I never had mm-hmm. sex with somebody and went back oh, once I moved that, on. Okay, what's your sign? Capricorn. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Boring. We are oh, lit. They're not boring. We are oh so God. lit. My mom is one. She's is boring she? as fuck. To you, she is. You don't to know you what she is. is. Yeah. yeah. Look at him. <laughs> to but you. She yeah. wasn't a freak, Nick. That don't mean she boring. <laughs> Joe, don't laugh. <laughs> Stay out of it, Joe. <laughs> my dad might have. You know what? Jalen Brown is from Atlanta. Okay. And they say we look alike. My dad might have been there in 96 when he was born. <laughs> and he actually, he, was, he did hit Frank Nick once. Mm-hmm. So he might have been there. And maybe I have a little brother that's 6'7 that plays right. for the Boston Celtics. Because <laughs> everybody keeps saying we look alike. Because who knows what happened, right? Who knows? I, I, I mean, mommy, he cheated on you. But look, he, that little boy, mil- he's a millionaire. <laughs> he made it farther than me and my brother. It. it was worth it. It was worth look it. it. Forgive him, y'all old now. <laughs> we got a little brother. He's he got he gonna pay for everything. Exactly. He's bring him to the family. Bring him in. I agree. <laughs> All right. Anything else for our guys? No, we got. Oh yeah, we got to do Walsh Wild News. Right. Oh yeah. Well, thank. Oh, first thing first. Yes. That was us doing shoot for shot. So there you go. Yes. You survived shoot yes, for shot. Thank now you. Thank shot. you. I am doing shot. Now now yes. <laughs> Cheers to that. Mm. That was fun. Oh, shit. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. We, that's how. <laughs> That's why when you see those damn clips and shit, those are the things that you see pop up. Like, they be just wild the whole time. Like, well, we actually have real interviews at yes, one point, and right. we don't just talk about sex all the time. Right. It's called a clip. Yeah. Of our show. <laughs> but we know that's what they they come they come to see us in our uh, I guess you could say breakdown of those type of topics. Right. Um, Let me get my glasses back on. Are you about to show us a clip or something? No, about to show you. not no clips. It's just gonna be a video. It's gonna be the article of this. Watch out, watch out, right. There we go. Turn it on. You know what I'm saying? We get keep TVs in this bitch. <laughs> Got all that. Miss all right. Maria's here, so please control yourself. Oh, damn it. Oh, no, it fell out. That's all. Who was that, Jess? <laughs> she owns the building. It should be coming up right now. All right. There we go. All right, no screaming, no yelling, no phones. That's oh, the name of the is that article. the teacher that was doing the Fight Club? Teacher, she was a it was a Florida teacher doing the Fight Club. Yeah, no, Scoobers. that's not cool. What? That's not cool at all. That's I don't Walsh agree Wild with news. that. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, look at her. <laughs> she <laughs> looks crazy. Yeah, she yeah, looks yeah. crazy. So Florida teacher hell. accused of organizing fights in middle school. I don't think that like because you don't send your kid to school for that. And if a kid gets into a fight at school, like let that adolescent shit play out. I don't think an adult should be egging on children fighting. Hear me out, but I like to gamble. Uh, oh, okay. okay. So, I might understand it a little bit. <laughs> no, I mean, like, you know, we say Florida man, so I guess now it's the women. Florida shit. woman. And yeah, then, right. Florida yeah. Woman. But look at her. She like, she like the She fight. looks crazy. She looks, she looks 20. They do a background check on her? She like, looks like a child. On? Yeah. yeah. She looks like a child herself. That. That's wild. I don't agree with that whatsoever. But yeah, in Tallahassee, Florida, a woman did, Identify as a teacher at Griffin Middle School in Tallahassee, Florida, is facing charges contributing contributing to delinquency of a minor. Exactly. Um, wow. Yeah. For what courts documents can all allege a role in organized fights in her classroom? Hear me out. Middle schoolers are horrible people. I agree with that. Everybody I do got cooked in middle that. school. I do agree no with that. No one left middle school unscathed. <laughs> oh my God. I At some middle point in middle school, school time. you got I cooked. Do agree. Oh, you got to fight. Guys. Something bad happened. That's wild. Agree. These kids probably wild. And it's like, you know what? Lock the doors. That's crazy. Who got money on this one? One, she broke the rule. First rule is you don't talk about Fight Club. Fight Club. Yeah, you don't talk. Yeah. That's rule yeah. number one of Fight yeah. Club. Rule number one. Yeah, you don't Somebody talked about Fight Club. There's some bitches. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Locking the door, no phones, no yelling, and they're fighting. That that's just crazy. Good. That's crazy. Yeah. It's uh-huh. in Florida too. That's what that's what Kimbo Slice from. He, that's what he started Uh-oh. in the backyard. Whatever yeah. happened to Kimbo Slice? He died. Oh, he died. No, he didn't. He, he really did. did? Nigga, nigga did years ago. Shut oh. up. Are they fighting? Are they concussions? Probably. Damn. He died. He died about like what? It's like it's been like six, seven years. Oh, he's <laughs> crazy. Okay. He's been I gone. didn't know that. I didn't. Yeah, I didn't. I, I, I forgot, kind of forgot about him. Yeah, Kimbo Slice. Would you gone. like your kid being in his class if he came home and his eye was black? You'd be fine with that. First thing first. You got a goddaughter. Your goddaughter in his class, and she come home with. That's crazy. Yes, I'm upset. Yeah. But second question I'm going to ask, did you win? (laughs) (laughs) Yo. How does the other one look? Yo. Oh, my gosh, yo. I completely disagree. My dad, remember I got suspended when I was like fifth grade. Oh no! I was in sixth, yeah, fifth grade, and I got in a fight. My dad, I got in the class, I got in the room, I got in my dad's car. 
one, I was going to school in Southeast DC. They they were crazy. They were crazy. And then I got in the fight. I get in the car with my dad. He looked at me like, "Did you win?" <laughs> I was like, "That is so crazy." <laughs> but you know what? I was a hard teenager. I, I fought a whole lot from like Did fourteen you? to like seventeen. Oh, every week I was fighting. I was from North Philly, so it was like every week I fought. Uh-huh. I hated it, but I just couldn't. You know, I wasn't gonna beat me up. Mm-hmm. I hated it so much. My grandmother used to be like, you "Don't come home." Trying to run from nobody. So yeah. you're going to fight oh, him outside you, you or I'm going to take beat. you outside to fight him. Oh, you got, yeah, that's yeah, real. So, that's yeah, real. so she would make me go out there and fight. I would oh, hate wow. it, like, hate it. I mean, but, you know, long run, it's kind of like, I survived. I'm still living. Yeah. So, no, that's like, good. Yeah. I mean, these kids these yeah. days, they're going to put the strap out. Oh, the for sure. Niggas are scared to fight these days. And the they have guns when they're, like, 13 years old. Yeah, they so, wild. Yeah. Niggas, we, wild. we were throwing hands for, like, up until niggas got to, like, 19, 20. Mm-hmm. Like, okay, they got guns. Now. Yep. <laughs> right. Like, yeah, they, they, the like, they lose the fight, they're going to start shooting. Right. But, but, right. But, but high school, middle school, we right. were rumbling. Yeah, yeah. It's nothing wrong with that. It's just the problem <laughs> of the teacher having the kids do it is wild to me. That's yes, wild. That's, that's the wild. horrible part. Yeah. That is very much the horrible part. Um, that is Actually, I had the other wild, wild news. Well, let me pull it up. Because it, it was Drake. It, it belonged to Drake um, and his jacket. I was just in Toronto like two weeks ago. You've been How there was before? it? I've been there. Boy, I love been. Toronto. I, love I, don't think, I don't think I could go. I love Toronto. Come on, DUIs. Really? <laughs> they won't let me play. I, I love Toronto. Toronto. Country yeah, I went for a show. Yeah. I love Toronto. It was cool. He can leave the country. He ain't got no felony. No. They, they, I'm dead serious. My man can't get in. Really? Yeah, I'm dead serious. Oh, really? I would have to get a favor. Somebody had to pull a favor in for me. I love Toronto. I love Quebec. I love Canada yes. in general. It's, it's so, nice. It's so lit there. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. 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 Yep. Hold on, here we go. Where's it? Where's Drake's jacket? This is what my uh, Waltz Wild News is. If it will load up. All right, here we go. It says, Hard feelings, harder dick. This is Drake's jacket. Drake is a fucking weirdo. I'm sorry. Why did, he doesn't need to do things like that because I have heard through people who know. <gasps> His dick is a height. Like, it's a height. That's what they say. Niggas, you know. That's what they say. So, <laughs> I, thought, I thought this was like uh, something that was just someone put on the jacket. This no, is like I think on that his is, jacket. That's his own jacket. Yeah, it's on his this jacket. is his jacket. Yeah, that's weird as shit. Yeah. So, yeah. but I still fuck Drake. Also, <laughs> the reason I? I say this is because <laughs> we're 30, he's 36. I'm 30, about yeah. to turn 37. That means oh. he's about to be 36. Yeah. We old. That's, don't don't do that. Yeah. It's we like, are. Uh, it's just weird. It's lit. Yeah, if you know, you know. 25 is lit. Yeah. We thirty something. Yeah, it's like stop. Yeah, that's weird. That's weird. Here at this point, yeah. you have a son. Maybe that's his. Maybe that's his cousin's brand. He's trying to promote his cousin's brand. He's hard sons, hard dick is not going to sell out. Well, it was ah, it was sell out. He wear it. He wear it. You're right. So it was sell out. His cousin's brand. He's probably helping his cousin with the brand. He's probably branding. his cousin from Memphis. His dad <laughs> on his dad's yeah, side. Yeah, he's somebody sure. who like what the fuck? Like okay. Yeah. Oh, his dad's side. I think that's up for Walt's Wild News. Right now. <laughs> okay. I ain't, I ain't, Okay. I ain't gonna pull up too much right now because you know I'm I'm gonna g- keep the party going and they about they it's like they about to have a fucking yes festival it's a fiesta yes it's like it's like it's about to warm up and shit <laughs> but Ish yes before we go mm-hmm. we know we used to do drunk stories mm. should we run the back right now mm, it's up to you yeah it's my freedom day let's do it <laughs> this is not the wild this is not your most drunkest. Okay. But something that happened to you when you were off the influence of alcohol. Oh my god. That you like, I will never forget. So I was and I these stories be the top of my head. I was gonna say you've been you're really great, good. You're a top great, of my head. Yeah. And you know, you, like, you have all if you can come like, like every you. week, yeah. you'll be lit. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you. Um so I was I was I was dating this guy and we had uh went to like we go see fights a lot. Went to this bar, I think it was like PJ Wellens, it's somewhere in Jersey. I didn't mean, I'm from Philly. Can I, can can I stop you real quick? Sure. When I, you, you said two things that just kind of boggled my mind. Okay. You met this guy, mm-hmm. you used to go see fights a lot, and y'all yes. went to a bar. Yes. So it was fights in a bar? So they show the fights, like, you oh, know, okay. the fights in a bar. I was Not like, you was going to a fight club. going to a fight club you shit. Know, fight club, no. <laughs> we would go see fights at the bar, right? Okay. So we got really drunk this one night. And on the way back home, we were dri- I was driving. I drove that night. I was driving home, and he was trying to eat my pussy Why in you the were driving? car while I was driving, right? No, I remember so my- it was a time, right? And I'm not to embarrass much. myself. And I don't mind yeah. embarrassing myself because, you know, whatever, right? You were yeah. driving with the left leg we and the right dri- leg up. Right. So we got back to my house. We go in the house, and he was, he, he was, I went to the bathroom. I came back out. I was like, all right, I'm ready to go. And he was trying to eat my pussy. Then he stopped. He said, all right, I can't do it no more. And I was like, what's going on? He said, you got tissue. Oh, on your pussy. Yeah, and I was so embarrassed, and that yeah. shit plays in my mind at least like twice a week. Once, yeah. one, he ain't a real nigga. He supposed to pull yeah. that tissue out. That, and, and I was, I'm like, this is 
this the first time is it, ever? Is it like little? Yeah, listen. Yeah. Huh? Is it? Tissue, is it little pe- like little pieces of toilet tissue? Or little like pieces. A, yeah, yeah, that yeah. happens. It to wasn't me all the a sheet. Time. You know what I yeah. mean? Like so, it's kind of like what the fuck? Like, yeah, but it, it was still embarrassing. You, you think it wasn't t- she says it's a tissue. It was tissue. It was, it was a tissue. tissue. It was tissue. Toilet tissue. I went to the, went to the restroom tissue. after we got back to the back yeah, to my house. Yeah, you think it was a and a, I came a, back a, out. A, a, a and he said he said he's, no, he said it was tissue. He said you got too much tissue. He said you got tissue on you. Uh, yeah, and I'm like, and that really plays in my head. Like, so that happens to me. I have I have um, f- uh, sticky fluids. Okay. So Ooh. like I do have tissue. Often, See, and so I feel know. better that it's not just me because yeah. ever since that I made sure I invested in wipes. I do wipes. I wipe yeah, my, I no, wipe I, I definitely the do the wipe, but yes. yeah, for sure. I yeah. like even when I take a shower in the morning or in the evening, whenever, and I wipe the first time with the wash rag, there's yeah. always tissue on it. Always. See, and I, I no was embarrassed. What. That's something yeah. you know that ruined the vibe. We couldn't fucking work. I that mean, that. it it kind of does throw throw it off a, right. a pinch, but Shit. it is what it Nigga. is. I was so for embarrassed. me. I'm like you. You thought through the vibe. That's why I went went and did the ass. You know, I look here. Ain't scaring me, baby. I'm gonna go eat the ass. It's move, time. It's time. On. It's time. Like, I'm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Tissue right there. I'm gonna eat ass. Look at now. We both we even. Let's get popping. Fuck you, mean. I'm here. I gotta see it through. I'm gonna come all the way up to your crib or hit my crib. Right. And we ain't gonna get popping. And I was thinking that, so I had to call like my exes. I was ex. I'm like, can I ever? They're like, that happens tissue? with all. Yeah. It like, happened with all girls. Yeah, it's fucking. Yeah. Yeah. being pretzy. It's yeah. something dry on something wet. Yes. It's going to transfer. Yeah. Like you're also, wiping like, fluid off of you. Yeah, right. Right. Lisa, I know you wipe, bitch. Like, it, it, come on, <laughs> give me some fucking credit. Oh, yeah. Give me some credit. At least you're not just pissing and letting it fucking air dry. Yeah, right. yeah. and let your panties right. soak Don't wipe it up. your hands up. Let's keep going. So that that plays my mind all the time. That's a good one. Great one. And follow up question. Where is the wildest place you ever had sex? It's a it's it's something called uh, Kelly Drive in Philly, and oh, it's yeah. like uh, you've been there before, right? I went to school. I went to Temple. Oh, okay. Yeah. So yeah, well, yeah. Kelly Drive yeah. is just like a uh, like it's a on scenic, the water. Yeah, yeah. scenery. Uh, scenic yeah, and it's on the water. And um, we would like back the truck up to there and open up the hood when it was raining, mm-hmm. and we would fuck right in there. People, it'd be like people in uh, Rojo. It's called um, uh, Boat House Row. Row House Row. Yep. Yeah, and people would be going by on the boats, and I had sex right there. It's a, nice, it's a nice area. It was, but yeah, yeah. but something I remember off the top. That's actually kind of yeah. dope. Yeah, now, it was fine. For the niggas that's hopping in your DMs, what what are you looking for? <laughs> oh my gosh, uh, I'm trying to help people out. I know. I like. I don't know. I like fun guys. I don't think I have a preference anymore. I used to like certain type of guys, but mm-hmm. now Makes I'm trying to like fun. I don't think I like. I don't think I like rough men. I'm out. No, I like. I like <laughs> all types of guys. Listen, <laughs> I, I don't have a preference. Um, but I like a smart guy. I like a funny guy. I'm gonna get a face set, but I ain't gangster. No, you don't get a face set. No, right. you, you have a nice face wall. Right you don't want to get a tattoo. Oh, right, I want to get the Rick Ross. Oh my right god, on the no. side with the sideburn. <laughs> please don't, yes, please don't. No, Mm-mm. but no, I yeah, I don't know. I like funny guys. I like funny guys, and f- I like fun people who funny guys and smart guys. It's hard to talk to a guy who doesn't have can't have a conversation. That's the part that I don't like when I'm looking at. Ja- I'm looking at. It's Jazz. hard to speak to a guy, to have a conversation with a guy who can't have a conversation. Oh like, yeah, most you know. men. I say this all the time. Like most men, I'm Jazz sorry. Jazz had somebody date with somebody that couldn't have a conversation one time. We most men about- are dumb and boring. No, I'm really, sorry. they are boring. I'm sorry. More They're than very anything, boring. They are very boring. Very boring. I say this all the time. Men are some. Sorry. Some really are very boring. Which is yeah. why I mean no. I mean this is not me. Sucking my own dick. It's like mm-hmm. I have a lot of female friends. Um, yeah. So when they come out, it's just like, hey. no, yeah. I mean, that, that's, wow. Well, yeah. I'm not <laughs> I my it. own I horn. It. I enjoy the phrase. The well, I'm not sucking my own dick. We're just, I'm saying, we're just saying, no. we're just, <laughs> we're just showing <laughs> all y'all homophobic niggas. Yeah, yeah. Get the fuck out of this conversation. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't care. Yeah, anyway, that, but no, me sucking that my own was, dick. Yeah, I have yeah, myself up. Right. I have a lot of female friends. Right. Because they hang out with me. They know it's. We go into the bar. It's gonna be a good we're time. Go like, <laughs> Jazz shot my first. So she got to hang out with me. We went to like four different bars. Mm-hmm. It was like a bar hop. And I, I love like, it. And we go there and we just having fun. I don't yes. like. I don't like people. As I say, I don't like people that's boring. Yes. And just taking everything too serious. Life yes. Is, life is serious, but when it's supposed to be serious, though. Yeah, but let's find the fun in between. Yes. We outside now. Exactly. We could be serious Monday when we got work. I- agree. <laughs> like, yeah. Or agree. when we have to have a real conversation. Yeah. But right now we outside. The sun is out. This bitch is shaking ass. <laughs> yeah, slap the ass. Like, yes. you know, like slap the like, ass. We, we, like, we doing shots. Like, yes. what the fuck you mean? Don't be approving. Like, why is she dancing? Like, no, nigga, the fuck wrong with you? Get out the club. Yes, agree. <laughs> I agree with that. I just don't like a boring ass guy. Mm. And people always say like now because I have a podcast that I'm using my personality to get dick. Like, that's how am I using my personality to get dick? You know, but that, you guys actually, like that? That's actually a compliment. Is it? 
No. Is it? I, 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 I don't know how to take that. I don't think I, so. I, it's a compliment. I mean, yeah. The best thing I can say about a woman, because is that you have a great personality. Okay. Reason why is because there are a bunch of bad girls. Out here. Women are fucking beautiful. Right, right. It's a bunch of bad bitches out here. Right. But you, like once your ass said, you go out to the bar with them, it's like, Boring. all she know is how to look good. Okay, right. I'm yeah. talking to the Boring. wall. Right? Yeah. I'm trying, I'm, la- I'm making jokes and it's just like, yeah. over the head. It's right. like, oh my God, why am I here? But she's bad. Now, and as you get older, like me, as I got older, it's like more so, I take it outside, as, as I got older, it was more so that uh, you could be bad, but the con- if the conversation ain't there, if, right. if, if, if if the chemistry ain't there when you hanging out with me, it's like I'm You're not, not turned. I'm not even turned yeah. on. Yeah. I'm not turned on. It could be a girl that I think is I right, and she's funny as fucking lit, and I'm like, yeah, I'm I'm knocking this down. Right, <laughs> I'm right. knocking this down. Right. I'm rolling with this. I'm wrapped. Right, yeah. So it's a, it's a compliment <laughs> they, yeah. they give it. Okay. To me, it is. Yeah. As, yes, I mean, not. but I'm simple. So to me, it's <laughs> simple. It's stupid. <laughs> stupid. Yeah, you're right. I'm not, not even saying that you're you right. don't look. I don't know if they're trying to say you don't look good or some shit, but you, that's a lie. No, they were but, saying that. I'm, they were saying that because I have a personality, I use that to get dick. No, like, you know, not without my but, looks or nah, whatever I got. That's going a on. weird I'm, thing to I say. I mean, the girls, yeah. that, use, that, right? the girls that just use looks are typically boring as fuck. Okay. Yeah. So okay. if you got a personality, that means you lit to me. Yeah. Okay, to me. Thanks, Walt. Well, I'm not going to take it. I'm just like, what? But I get it. Thank you. They yeah. was hating. It was hating. <laughs> yeah. Tell everybody how you can find you. Um, you can find me at Isha Heart Out Pod. That's on um, Instagram, Twitter, and on uh, TikTok. Um, IshaHeartOut.com. We have a website. I'm having Ooh. a brunch May 7th in Philly. You guys should slide. Is it where? A brunch May 7th okay. in Philly. That's a Sunday. It's, um, yes. Or Saturday. You guys, a Sunday. A okay. Sunday, May 7th. Yeah, you guys weekend, should that's definitely. The, that's the weekend of Secret um, Mile. Might be, yeah. a little, might be a little tough. Uh, it is Secret Mile, right? Yeah, we, yeah, we but get it's the next day. We have but, a booking. No, no, yes. Secret Mile is Friday. That's Sunday. So okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, yes. So I haven't um, been feeling in a while, so I might have yeah, to. Yeah, I mean, I hope you guys saw it. But right, uh, uh, what you call it? I know y'all friends too. Um, what's her name? Uh, 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 Zaria. Zaria. I don't know her. Really? No. Zaria. So where else can we find you? Okay. Continue to tell us. <laughs> I yeah. love Ted. She's so crazy. She's like anyway. Um, but um, but yes, the podcast page. Uh, and um, you know, on uh Apple and Spotify and anywhere you you know listen to your podcast. So yep. And then I have a personal page. She ish she underscore e s s h. And um, I'm around. Yeah, Yay. check me out, guys. Yeah, okay, enjoying yeah. the podcast game. I see you, man. I you got show us love, man. We got come. We got. We got to be on no one. No, everybody's scared to bring us on their show. Y'all have to come. Y'all have to come. I think we're going to wild out too much. We I not. I love it. I'm all for it. Please. I hope you guys have fun. Mm-hmm. I have fun. I, I have, have a good time. Fun. We always have yeah. fun. Yeah. We always have you're fun. Actually good, you're actually a good A good, good guest. Thank you yes. very much. Trust me, I you appreciate weren't, it. You waited about 15 minutes ago. Really? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She would have to be like... <laughs> Wrap it up. Yes, yes. Like, this nigga it boring out. as fuck. Let's get it going. We got our little highlights. Let's go. Yeah. No, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Yeah. Happy to have you on. Thank you. Guys, do we have anything coming up? Well, um, only thing we got coming up because when this comes out, we will already did the Learn Lando. Uh, yeah, actually, we, we, we are all host this one, two, three. We're hosting yes. together yes. At, the, at the show. Tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> 2000 show. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. I got an outfit. I got, yeah, me too. Mm-hmm. You got an outfit? I'm not doing anything because I got to go to my cousin's birthday. <laughs> Party after that and all that shit. I ain't you always book. I've been in the house <laughs> for three months. He outside, y'all. What is outside? I like, I, my, week, my next three weeks are booked. Booked book, book and busy. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I got it, bro. All right there. So, like, like I said, well, um, we will be doing that. But, um, like I said, me and Jazz will be in Atlanta, like we've been saying for the last few weeks, on the twenty second at the Black Fest, a uh, Black. Podcast Fest, Black uh, the Black Effect. Effect. Sorry, Black Effect Podcast Fest with uh, Charlemagne, our girls. Uh, we talk Bat Podcast will be out there. Um, we just come and show love, but it's Jazz's birthday. That's gonna be Jazz's birthday. Hey. One, Jazz will know I'm taking care of everything. She ain't paying for shit. It's her birthday. Talk heavy. She already, she already, <laughs> I mean, she paid enough. She got, we got the flight and everything. So look at we, we out there. And I just upgraded my flight because it's my birthday. Yeah, yes, do it first big. For her class. First class, yeah, I had to. Balling it. Yes. Give it back, looking at the hey man, how's it? How's it? <laughs> Texas, is, is, is and it you know, <laughs> you got, got Wi Fi up here. <laughs> and you know, I got clear, so I'm leaving your ass at the yeah. gate. Like, you, wait, you know, yes. I, yeah, I'm, my, and the fucked up thing is, I'm gonna be leaving the club. I ain't gonna go to sleep because I'm gonna be leaving the club. Yeah. Like, That's how you three, go. Three, four in the morning. No, like, so I got, I got right, priority. I got regular priority coming back because I was like, I'm gonna flop into that seat. It doesn't matter what seat I sit in. Oh no, I'm okay. Yeah, you coming back early? Yeah. I'm I'm staying in Atlanta like 2 p.m. Oh no, back. I got an early flight because I want to be back so I could 
I want to lay down in my own bed. Yeah, I know that's right. Bad, but yeah, no, yes. um, we'll be in Atlanta for the Black Effect Podcast Festival. Uh, actually, I've been seeing a lot of podcasts. You should pull up. A lot of podcasts say, like, hey, we're going to be there. Book us. We might not have time, but mm-hmm. we're going to be there. Talk to us. Give us, I mean, help me out with the drinks and shit because, you know, I'm paying for everything <laughs> for dress. So, but yeah, so check us out there. That's all we have coming up as of right now. Yeah. That we could, we could speak about. Yeah. That we can speak about because the ink ain't dry on other things. So, mm-hmm. all right, guys, please make sure you're following us on social media on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. Please make sure you're subscribed to our YouTube channel. That's where you can find full episodes. And wherever you listen, please make sure you're downloading so we get the streams. All right, yes. once again, it's Tequila Talk. My name is Walt Light Walt. We are out. Bye, guys.